My goodness, I missed that. I missed that one. G'day, everybody. How's it going? Mad Dab, that feels like it's been forever since I've seen you. Mikey, how you doing, mate? Spurk, nice to see you. Farmer, the legend, the man, the myth, the farmer. How is everybody? How's the uh, shoulder freedom going, farmer? How is it going? Uh, so, I thought... I know, I, I think too much. I thought that, um, there we go. That's a bit better. Neri, hello darling, how are you? Uh, so it's been so long. Ah, uh, yeah, we're good, thank you. I hope you are well as well. That's all right. It's nice to see you though. And it's nice to see you too, Neri. Oh, I hope everybody's all right. I hope everybody's keeping well during these really weird times. The range of motion slowly coming back. Beautiful. I'm sorry, Neri. We're farming tonight. Hokey Pokey and I are farming for the first part of tonight. And then when she goes to bed, we're going to swap over to something else. And I was sitting there thinking when I was doing it, oh, Neri's going to be upset at me. She doesn't like farming. So, everybody, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Are you feeling better, Neri? We have somewhere around here, somewhere around here, we have Hokey Pokey. Are you there, Hokey? I'm here. Hello, everyone. Yay. Hokey Pokey's here. Are you in your tractor? I don't quite know when to say hello because you just talk. I know. I talk, <laughs> I talk too much. You might have to actually, um, you might actually have to drop your volume a little bit. There she is. Okay. She's in a nice, she's in a nice simmy shirt there. Yay! We haven't had hokey pokey on for a while, have we? So yeah. So I thought, well, I, I've been away for a week for work and stuff, and um, what better a way to spend the night with hokey pokey still, and um, to be able to just hang and chill and be able to chat to you guys. So, so I thought we'd do some farming. And we are we are in the Swiss Alps now. This is all this is all Hokie's farm over here. All of this stuff that's all her sheep and her crops. And as you can see, you're going to be disgusted, farmer. Look at all the weeds in her crops. Look at all the weeds in her crops. How's my volume now? Perfect. Perfect. Can everybody hear everybody all right? You guys can hear Pokey all right, and you can hear me all right, can't you? as well as the game it looks like it's all right oh good excellent excellent so what have you been up to mad deb since we seen you last you can see there that uh, my weeds are all have all been sprayed and killed thanks farmer so farmer should be proud of me and should be disgusted in hokey pokey because her weeds aren't sprayed and killed well, I didn't get a chance, did I? No. So, I've got corn growing here. Keeping safe, making sure car is cool. I've been missing you guys, yeah. I, I miss everybody when they uh, when we haven't seen them for a while, but it's nice when people pop back in. It's awesome. It's awesome. So, we've got some corn. We've got some... Uh, rather have some weeds and not use chemicals, yeah. Problem with this game is that if you um if you don't if you don't spray the weeds with herbicide then you lose thirty percent of your crop. So got some canola here. But it's probably second stage of growth, which is a beautiful little field. And we've got some oats over here. I'm growing some oats because uh tonight I am going to uh purchase some horses. So that we can start uh, start training up uh, horses and sell horses. So yeah, you've got to use them in. Uh, actually, Hokey Pokey has one of those farmer, and you've. Uh, I'll see if I can find it. Have you bought your weeder back yet, Hokey? Uh, I was going to buy a weeder, and I ended up getting the spray instead. Uh, okay, she so she doesn't have. You can get them in here. Look, I'll, I'll show you, farmer. Uh, where are we up here? Uh, weeders, there's, there's a, there we go. You can get the mechanical ones here. So, uh, yes, I think it is awesome. I think it's awesome, Mad Deb. And the reason why I do is because it, um, 
it does come with a lot of extra equipment. So it's got, um, uh, let's see, it uh, it comes with uh, with this bureau, this old bureau here. Um, it also comes with uh, the first electric tractor, which is this little, I mean, this is what, 68 horsepower. It's probably only really good for mowing and towing stuff around, but um, uh, not mowing with uh, with a butterfly on the back and uh, and a mower on the front though, because I don't think it has enough power. Uh, so yeah, new brand, which is Ridgy Track, um, which is really popular over in um, over in Switzerland. Um, and there's a there's a larger Ridgy Track there, which is a 110 horsepower. The only problem is none of the tractors, except for the new Lindner that comes out with it, um, like these tractors, they don't have a. Oh, this one does. The uh, the little one doesn't. Uh, these two don't have a uh, don't have a. Um... G'day Naz, how you going, mate? How are you this evening? So I think it's uh, as you can see. Th this is all new. Um, this is all new. Uh, stuff that comes with this alpine farming pack so uh, as well as a bit of quite a bit of equipment so I'm, I'm enjoying it I'm doing a series on YouTube on it as well how are you tonight Nez hope you're well hello daughter because I'm sure you're sitting there as well just finish your dinner <laughs> there we go we're uh hokey hokey's on hokey pokey's on hello <laughs> So these are my sheep here. I need to cut the grass, obviously. Uh, this is the food. This is my food for my sheep that I have sitting here. So, did um, did my uh, good, did my good daughter mention uh, mention the uh, the game that we were talking about, Naz? I might talk to you about it later. Perhaps. All right. So there you go. So this is my farm. Basically, what we did is we, um, what we basically did, both of us, is we uh, we bought a field each, as opposed to starting off. I think you start off up here in this area. Oh yeah, no worries. That's cool. All good, Naz. Um, start, you normally start off in this area, but what we've done is we've uh, we've bought a field each and we're building up our houses and our farms around those fields so as you can see i've changed stuff around here so so we're just sort of uh creating everything from scratch basically but uh the first thing that we want to do is i want to get my controller there we go yeah, no, that's that's easy. I just thought of you. Just thought of you, mate. Thought it might be something that you're interested in. So, all right. So we're going to get some horses. I've got I've got uh, I've got some homemade water tanks on the back there. So I'm going to use those to um. Going to use those to fill up the water trough over here. I've also got some pallets of food here that I pre-purchased and the reason why I pre-purchased the pallets of food was because uh, I haven't grown, my oats haven't grown yet so once we harvest the oats then we'll be able to feed the horses. Uh, you're, you're a big equipment kind of guy. There we go, I like, yeah, because yeah, cause you get to do that in real life, absolutely. That makes sense. All right. Um, whereas I love the I love the smaller equipment. So now where are we? So what we're going to do is we're going to buy a few horses. I'm going to see what I can afford. Um, I reckon Gailey Lame would probably want to pick what horses I get. So I was thinking maybe one of each. Maybe we could get one of each horse. Might be pretty good. Got coffee in my cyberpunk mug, so I'm happy. I need a straw for my coffee. It's really hard to drink sideways because oh. of my microphone. Because <laughs> you got your microphone on. I might get, uh, oh, yeah, definitely. Totally agree, Farmer. 
Totally agree. Um, I think we might get one of each of them. What do you reckon? That's what we'll do. We'll, we'll get one of each. You have to give them really cool names. Yes. All right. So what we'll do is we'll confirm that. Need a grey for the Scots greys. <laughs> All right, so we'll confirm. we've got one of each now. We've got uh, the grey, the pinto, the palomino, the chestnut, the bay, the black, the seal brown, and the dun. Greedy. Greys are pretty. There you go. They are actually pretty, aren't they? Name submissions. Yes. Okay. So there's forty thousand. So as soon as we get, um, as soon as I get the the water and the food in and some straw in for them. We can uh, we can do we can do a naming thing so and everybody can name a horse or two. Uh, let's see what do we want to do? Let's see how much water they are going to take. I'm not sure how much water they're going to take. We're probably going to need a couple of runs. So Tito for the grey. All right, Tito for the grey. Let me feed them. Let me get them uh, watered and fed first. Look out, sheepies. So we're running a couple of mods on this. As you can see, I've got my old Zill. Have you got the old Zill, farmer? I always like having an, an old tractor as well as a yard tractor that I use for little bits and pieces, so. I'm just filling up the store again. <laughs> you buying a heap of stuff again. There <laughs> we go. get a harvester. Well, they're taking a, quite a bit of water, aren't they? But there's quite a few horses in there, so let's have a look at what they're at. I'm just using a controller for this, guys. Uh, let's see. Water, there we go. They've, they've got plenty of water now. <laughs> Mikey, thanks for the redeem, mate. It's been a while since the goat has screamed. Here we go. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I have the most awesome daughter. Seriously. Okay, let's... um. <laughs> that's a... That's a goat scream. That is a that is a goat that my daughter bought for me for Father's Day as part of my gift, and um, ever since I played it on stream, everybody's gone absolutely mad over it. So, uh, so now it's a redeem, and people are just redeeming goat screams all the time. It's a cracker. Uh, let's see. Let's get this. Let's get this on. Oh, what happened there? No wonder it wouldn't pick up. There we go. <laughs> Look, it's a um. I don't know whether you can see it. There, it's a uh, it's a little goat, and it screams. <laughs> Everybody loves the goat scream. I think it's the only reason people come here. That and hokey pokey. All right, let's move that in there. <laughs> it did scare the poo out of you. Uh, crack up. Okay, so... Oh, did I, did I get the seeds out or did I get the... No, I got the oats out. Got the oats out. Thank you very much for the sub. Deb, thank you so much. Four months. Four months. How oh, awesome. Sorry that you're getting... um. Sorry that you're getting a little bit of feedback, guys. It's coming through Hokey Pokey's microphone. Uh, that is not working. That is not working. Blame the goat. <laughs> uh, you'll learn to love the goat. You will learn to love the goat. Absolutely. Do you want me to try and turn it down a bit more and just try and position it closer to my face? Dead? Your microphone? No, that's all right. That's fine. It's not working. <laughs> Bullfrog, how you doing? 
How you doing, mate? Yes, you did hear a goat. You did hear a goat. Um, yes, that you'll see on the Nightbot now that there's a link to Hokey Pokey's uh, Facebook art page, and that will also um, that will also on her page give you links to her social media stuff for her artwork. So check it out if you uh, haven't. Oh, it's not working. It's not working. Um, well, what I could do... <laughs> Okey pokey <laughs> bean. She's on, Bullfrog. She, she's actually on, so she's just being Hello quiet. there. She's just being quiet. Um, for some reason, this is not working. And that's not going to be good. What's not working? Uh, my palette of um, my palette of food. Hey, Gailey Lame, how you doing, darling? Hello. Are you talking to moi, or are you talking to the pokey there, Cap? Are you ready for some uh, GTFO tomorrow night? It's going to be interesting, isn't it? Oh, it's just not working. Can't find a spot for it. This header is so small, I regret this. What time? What time? What tomorrow night? GTFO. Uh, we're we're actually recording it for YouTube. So tomorrow night. Self. <laughs> is that is that Hokey's personal record? Is it? <laughs> um, I'm doing a lot of training. Yeah, just recording for YouTube, sweetie. So, as you're probably all aware, South Australia has gone into, went into a COVID lockdown and uh, had some COVID scares and stuff. And uh, poor old Gailey Lame has been working in, uh, in a supermarket with a whole pile of... Um, with all of the uh, mad panic buyers and stuff like that. No, the pioneer bags you can get um, you can get horse feed and uh, and chicken feed and stuff as well, farmer. I'll show you. Let's see. Uh, across here, so you've got uh, seeds. Uh, you've got fertilizer, lime, uh, pig food. <laughs> Nil, Nil Caesar. Is it Nil Caesar? Or Nil Caesar? Uh, oh, Naz. He, so I'm sorry, Naz. I didn't see your redeem for the goat scream. <coughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. Nil, uh, Nil Caesar? I hope I've got that right. Nil Caesar 94. Yeah, she's she's had to put up with uh, with all the panic buyers, everybody buying all the toilet paper. See, there we go, um, farmer oat and wheat. So you can get wheat for the uh, chickens and oat for the uh, for the uh, horses and pig food as well. So not all your toilet paper, yeah. No, that's all right, Neri. How how are you feeling, Neri? I'm trying to hit the trigger. It's not working. I'm not very. Uh, I'm not very happy about this, to be honest. Yeah, everybody went into crazy, uh, crazy shutdown mode and panic buying and all that type of stuff. I was. I was in New South Wales all last week, and um, I was worried that I wasn't even going to get back. So. Hurty, <laughs> you're hurty. That's all right. I'm sure Bullfrog's looking after you, though. 
I hope Bullfrog's looking after you. Well, that's not working, is it? I have used them before. Definitely not working. Now it should be in this trigger area. Uh, what we could probably try and do is, uh, without killing our sheep, is possibly go inside and see if it will trigger inside. I doubt that's the reason. Excuse me, sheepy. But if that's the case, the horses aren't going to have anything to eat until my oats are ready. Which is going to be a problem. Uh, let's see. Got a lot of ammo animals there. I do, indeed, I do. Gaily Lame's healing vibes are the best vibes in the world, Neri. I can vouch for that. Oh, is it going to fit in with the uh, ibis on the back? Christina, how you doing? I do, mate. I do. I have the oat. I have the oat bags, mate. Sorry, horsey. I'm just going to just warp through you there. <laughs> you see my magic horses? I breed magic horses. Did you see that, Neri? That's a magic horse. Only the best farmers breed magic horses and sheep and sheep. Alright, that's not working. Uh, maybe I can... Maybe what we can do is maybe put it in here. Do you think it'll go in here? No, it won't even go in there. Okay. Very nice levitation. Very nice levitation. How are you doing tonight, Christina? Yes, they can. My horses can. My horses can do anything. All right. Okay. So we need to sort this. Uh, we need to sort this problem out, don't we? Uh, let's see. How are we going to fix this? Far right side in the corner. Uh, which which far right side? It's not the wrong type of feed, it's the right, they eat oats. Uh, we've got this. Do you mean uh, in the far right corner of this? Or... Or do you mean in the far right corner of the yard? Uh, where I am now, okay, right over here, alright, let's try that. Okay. Let's see what we can do. It's strange because I've never had them not work before. But then it's been a long time since I've had any horses in farm sim as well. Oh no. Just painted a dirt dot in the middle of my field. A dirt dot. Are you painting the ground? I was trying to just change the settings to paint, yeah. Yeah, it's supposed to be the same trigger. Uh, Alright, well, I think maybe what we're going to have to do is go and buy ourselves a couple of hay bales, maybe. I reckon, because you can't... Uh, let's see. Wrong, wrong hole. We're going into that hole. Uh, oat and hay, yeah. Um, Alright, we're going to have to go and buy a couple of hay bales. Just outside the box, okay, hang on a sec. Try that. 
Yeah, I will. I'll buy one hay bale. I mean, uh, our oats should be our oats shouldn't be too far away from being ready anyway. So. I've also got this mod on here that Hokey Pokey found. So do you reckon just outside on this side? No, that's not working. Well, that's a, that's some bad tractor work there. I hope Farmer didn't see that. No, I think I'm going to have to go and uh, grab some bales. No, you don't normally. Normally, it should just um, cap. Normally, it just uh, just opens it like it just empties itself. So. <laughs> G'day Sack, how you doing? Uh, they're actually not, they're actually not, um, they're actually not eating grass. They don't have grazing. Um, they have grazing on some mods and stuff, but they don't have grazing in this one. So, so we're going to have to go and get ourselves some, uh, some hay, I think. Look out, sheepy. Go and get ourselves two bales of hay. And uh, we'll go from there, I reckon. Uh, they they shouldn't empty into a trailer they um, because they're, they're made to stack on a trailer when you transport them from the store. They are smelling the grass. That's what they're doing. Checking it out. Smelling each other's uh, body business. Body business. <laughs> That's it. Body business. All right, bring that up. Actually, they might load into. Actually, you're right. They might actually load into. Um, they might actually load into a tipper. As opposed to a, uh, yeah, we'll try that. Uh, what do we got there? Let's disconnect that. Get the old uh, Massey around here and we'll bring this tipper over and see if they load it. They might actually load into that. You might be right there, Mikey. Because this is um, this trailer is a uh, it's it's not a it's not a uh, flatbed or anything so so we'll see if that works. Now I'm going to have to change my pallets over my uh, forks over again. Actually, I'm going to just just cringe, but I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to pick these up with the uh, bale spikes. I'll probably bend the bale spikes now. Uh, let's see. So it was a crazy week last week. Nearly died on the roads last week in New South Wales. Driving along the highway at a uh, at a hundred kilometres an hour, and um, and somebody in a Kia Carnival decides to cross a crossroad right in front of us on the highway, without even looking, had to lock everything up, stopped a couple of inches away from them. Yeah, farmer, don't look. That's it. <laughs> Let's see if they empty into here. Doesn't look like they're going to. Okay. Alright, 
until we sort that one out. Just as long as Farmer can't see me doing this with bale spikes. Poor guy, he'll put his shoulder out. Never trust a Kia driver, that's exactly right. It was, uh, it was really, really scary, Christina. It was really scary. There has to be a bug in it. I reckon you're right. Because uh, that should work, because I've used them before. No, that's not going to work. Come on, go down, go out. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm glad that you're just ignoring it. I don't want you to put another shoulder out in in a in fi, in a fit of disgrace, Sir Farmer. Uh, let's see. Let's put in our uh, flashing lights there. Beautiful. All right, we will uh, head down to the sh down to the store there. Maybe there's uh, maybe there's some sort of bug in um, in the uh, animal pen. Maybe Mikey. So uh, pull the trigger up alongside the big bag of oats and just refill the tipper directly from the big bag. Ah, okay. So you reckon, uh, okay, so you reckon I, I should be able to fill up before we do that, you reckon I should try and uh, fill up that trailer? We shall try and do that, we'll try not to uh, kill Hokie's chickens. She doesn't have any chickens yet. <laughs> Don't kill my invisible chickens, it's about time I buy some isn't it? It's about time you buy some. I'm just harvesting the wheat now. With my tiny little harvester. A tinsy harvester. Let's see what we can do. Let's try this before we go. Alright. So we've got crop destruction on as well, so we've got to be really careful of the crops. It's a shame rail isn't here. It's that, that, that train goes past every every couple of minutes. Alright, here we go. Buy that weeder, because I feel sorry for the sheep. Because <laughs> you spray over the top of the sheep? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so now you'll just uh, run the weeder over the top of them? Yes. It's like a little uh, back scratch. Slightly more humane, isn't it? All right, let's see. Let's see how this goes. Ah, perfect. Thank you so much, Mad Deb. That solved our problem. Excellent, excellent, excellent forum searching and surfing there. All right, so we should go over and uh, feed these guys now. Dodge the sheep. Oh, buddy, buddy, buddy. There we go. I know you can drive straight through them, but I feel kind of guilty. Do you feel guilty driving straight through them, Hokey? I do. Alright, I'm not sure that that is going to suffice. Uh, whoa, that's practically nothing. We'll keep monitoring that though until, um, because our oats might come in off the field. So probably tomorrow, so we can probably monitor that I reckon. Uh, let's see, let's dump that.
There we go. What DLCs do you have for this farmer? Okay, we'll grab that and we will throw that straw out. All but this one. Okay. The, uh, what is it? The, the ball galt? Or something DLC? The stuff that just has all the equipment? That doesn't look too bad. I don't have that one, I don't think. All, all but the alpine one, is it? Uh, oh, yeah. So do you do the, uh, do you do the big, um, all the big, uh, really big American farms and stuff, sir? see what's going on all right so our straw should be it should be enough plenty of straw plenty of straw there all right so guys here we go what was the name of the uh what was the name of the gray horse neary can't remember what you said tito did you say tito t-i-t-o uh, use mods as well. Uh, I'll sh we've only got a few mods in this though, uh, in this one. Um, but <laughs> in, in Hokey Pokey's of my farming sim 17 days, uh, we, uh, Tito, Tito right there. Uh, in, in Hokey and Pokey, uh, Hokey Pokey's of my farm sim 17 days man we just had hundreds of mods look look at that this is what i don't understand about farming sim tito so they get rid of the i and replace it with a hash because tito I, like what uh, okay yeah there you go <laughs> uh. It's crazy. It's like Simidium. They won't. Um, they won't do Simidium. Which bit is it they cross out on that? Simidium. Yeah. Uh, one of the. Uh, uh, actually, I don't know. Where are you? Yeah. Hi. Now uh, let me just. Um, let me just disconnect that and turn that off. I'll come over and you can tell me which one. There we go, I'll just jump out of there. Is it hovering above your head? Yeah, it should be hovering above my head. Where are you? I'm harvesting my wheat. Ah, uh, okay. Mate, my boy, we, we weren't all thinking it. I wasn't thinking it. I wasn't thinking it. There she is. So what does it say? Simi dollar sign I O M. Okay, so the so, uh, the D. Mid. Hmm. Simidium, and it and it and it does does out the D. So tell tell me what that means, guys. Hmm. Why would it do that? Sim <laughs> Sim stars in seven days to farm. A thrilling, <laughs> thrilling horror movie. Yes, indeed it is. Okay, just a little bit of liquid fertilizer on the corn. Get it all happening. Uh, idiot, yeah, maybe. It's, yeah, maybe that's it. Maybe idiot's it. Okay, then just I'm be idiot, sure. though. Wouldn't it? Um, I don't know yeah, what it is. Maybe, it's just, maybe it just picks up stuff that's nearly a bad word. <laughs> it's just stupid. I got banned from um, I got banned from um, from World of Warcraft because I called my character Camel Toe, <laughs> but she had camel feet, so that's why I called her Camel. Well, maybe, but I got banned from World of Warcraft though. Because somebody took somebody when I was in a dungeon, somebody took offence to it, 
and they uh, and they reported me and I got banned. So uh, let's see. I'm just driving over all of the cro yeah face palm exactly. Uh, is it? It's ah. Uh, it doesn't show that it's censored. Sack. She said, "Idiot." Can everybody else see that? Um, see Gailey Lame's. Um, I can see that. That's bizarre. Well, maybe, maybe Sack. Maybe your mum. Maybe your mum has. Um, has put on a child has put on child censorship on your computer. Is it uh, like a per country thing? It says hostile message blocked. Hmm. Everybody else can see it. It was a very hostile message. Shame on you. Yeah, shame on you, Gaily Lame, for being so hostile. Yeah, it might be. It might actually be per country, mightn't it? Do 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 do. -do. <laughs> it's warm enough to sleep outside here today, tonight. It is. It's actually very warm. I think that's probably why Lana Banana isn't here. She's probably fainted. Mm, warm enough to sleep outside sans blankets. <laughs> Don't corrupt you Kiwis. <laughs> you Kiwis are already corrupted. Alright, off we go. A little bit of that. Uh, now we need to come up with words that Sack can't see. <laughs> That's hilarious, Christina. <laughs> yeah. Uh, words that Sack's mum won't let him see because she censored his computer. She put a child lock on his computer. <laughs> uh, we're all picking on you now, Sack. <laughs> Uh, all right. Uh, how's that? How's that going? Let's see. Let's see what we've got here. Um, fertilizer state. Let's turn off plowing. Yep, that's pretty cool. All right, perfect. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah. So I did. Um. So I decided to do farm sim tonight because uh because i can just chill out and and keep interacting with you guys i haven't seen everybody for like a week over a week so actually i don't know whether i streamed uh i can see camel toe it's not allowed on uh, world of warcraft if somebody takes offense to it i'll tell you that much <laughs> Touching tale of Sim trying to woo Hokey, <laughs> but can he survive a deadly pokey bean? <laughs> Tune in channel 60 to see more. Oh, Sack can, Sack can see Camel Toe. So they're obviously happy with Camel Toe in, uh, in NZ. Okay, beautiful. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. I always do that. Press the wrong button. <laughs> uh, let's see. What was the, what was the, I'm losing track now. References to stupidity is not makes a person wonder. I know it does. It does. Do you know what? I We got um, um, Hokey on her, on her previous... I think on her previous art page or something, got, got a guy one day um, posting really nasty stuff to her, like calling her a, a, an FC and all that type of stuff and um, posting it. And I took photos of it and, um, and put in a complaint to Facebook about it. And uh, and they came back and said, no, he hasn't. No, that guy hasn't, um, 
hasn't uh, upset any of the policies, so they were fine with that. with that. Yeah, they were absolutely fine with it. I think it was, it was messaging me creepy stuff. And I he was messing, yeah, yeah, he was messing you creepy stuff. You he got upset. Yeah. And then he got upset and started abusing her. And, and like and ho and um and Facebook said even with pictures of his messages and stuff, um Facebook said oh no he hasn't he hasn't um he hasn't gone against our policies everything's okay. So yeah, that was at the, that was at the same time as um, paintings with boobs in them were, wouldn't be taken down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, people are allowed to talk like that. Should have fired the pokey beam at his ass, yes. <laughs> <laughs> if, uh, if, uh, well, Mikey's on, you, you might get banned. You might get banned. Oh, serious? Uh, That's unbelievable, Mad Deb. Like, the people just, I don't know, it's just such a, a childish and horrible world, isn't it? It really is. Unbelievable. All right, perfect. Uh, nobody will ever stop you from charging your laser. You are correct. I know, that's why I hardly ever play multiplayer games, to be honest. That's unbelievable. And and like for for a ten year old that's probably a little bit um I won't say traumatic, but it's a little bit um unnerving, isn't it? For somebody that age. It'll never be fully charged because you're always uh you're always taking people out with it. Cap. Okay, uh, that one. This is some very flat lands we've got here for we do. somewhere with very hilly, hilly areas. We do. So, are you guys ready for are you guys ready for tomorrow night's recording? Because this game is going to be uh, is going to be pretty awesome. I did, I did. I've I've actually spoken to the devs about getting a key, but I haven't heard back from them. And I did it about a couple of weeks ago. I spoke to a Mikey. It looks awesome, mate. I reckon we should. I reckon we should look into doing that. What do you reckon? You gonna sleep early? Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, it does. It looks very, very fun, actually. So I reckon. Um, I reckon if we get maybe, I, I, how many people? How many people can play it, Mikey? Four. Yeah, it'd be good to get four people together to play that, wouldn't it? I think maybe we should do it. We should look into it. Oh, I hope you left her bucket here. We could, uh, we could actually, um, we could <laughs> steal her bucket, couldn't we? If you hadn't have said anything, you probably could have, and I would have forgotten that it was even there. Uh, I, I would never do that to you, Hokey. So I think this uh, this GTFO is is going to be awesome. It's all about sneaking as much as you possibly can, but apparently when stuff goes down, it really goes down. So uh, let's see, change color. What, should we do it? Should we do it in uh, massy red, or should I leave it black? <laughs> yes, Sim stars in the Great Hokey Bucket Heist. I've been in a few <laughs> movies tonight. I reckon we'll do it like that. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Sorry, Mikey. It looks it looks good, yeah. It should be it should be pretty good. It'd be a really good one. But I don't know whether um I still haven't worked out whether I'm gonna do that premium thing or not. Because I just realised that if I do that premium thing um, on YouTube, even if it's only for a dollar or something, um, then devs aren't going to be able to see 
the uh, the videos that I've put up of their games when I'm um, when I'm reviewing games and stuff. So might be a bit of a problem. Farmer will probably be upset with me because I don't have my uh, I don't have my beacon light on. You're always telling me off for that. I am. It's going to be a. Uh, it's going to be very interesting. The old trigger happy uh, laser boy is probably going to cause a few problems there. I reckon, Gailey Lame, Mister, the old Captain Bullfrog. Yeah, yeah, they wouldn't either, would they? Actually, good point. Way too late to honk. <laughs> I am going to need a bucket to hold all of my cash sir you are correct look at this mess that these guys have made let's bring that down this this um this front end bucket mod thing is um is one of the best mods that I've got, the one that shows you exactly what status your bucket's at. Well, this is a little bit hard in the grass to do this. Am I hitting the... I might be hitting the thing. There we go. <laughs> there was censoring in your chat in your chat settings as well. There you go. Oh, if you need to try it out, let me know. <laughs> oh, goodness me. You know my my favourite part of uh, my favourite part of farm sim work is uh, doing front loader work. I love it. Absolutely love it. I could do it for hours and hours and hours, I reckon. Painting the ground. <laughs> you do spend some time painting the ground, and don't you? And putting in trees. And cutting down trees. Hi, I'm DJ. Hello. Welcome. How you doing? Welcome back. It's nice to see you. Seen a few people that we haven't seen for a while. All right, there we go. That's done. Um, now, gonna have to keep our horses clean as well. I have, I have uh, cheated a little bit. I, I will admit, I have cheated a little bit, and uh, I've, um, I've actually got the horse helper on. So. Pokey, Pokey's going around punching. She, she, she goes around punching everything, Far. Um, Cap. It's very, very violent. Very so violent. Aggressive. Very violent. It's scary sometimes, <laughs> to be honest. It does, it does. It's the first time I've actually, to be honest, Farmer, it is the first time that I've actually used, it's the first time that I've actually used it, so. I've never even tested it out before, so it should be okay. All right. Uh, how are you, MD? MD, are you good? It's lovely to see you. All right, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna have to give this area a mow. You should check out. You should see my windrower that I'm using, farmer. It's awesome. Maybe what we should do. Do you have a uh, a uh, tether, honey? I don't. Sorry. Ah, uh, useless. Do 
you need one for the horsies. Yeah. What's up, Gailey Lane? Thanks, Mad Deb. Thank you for gifting. Thank you for the gift. Gifted sub. That's wonder. That's so wonderful for you. Um, Gailey Lane, what's 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 up? You fear for your safety? I I I. Oh uh, yeah, no, I got it. I got it with Hokey Pokey. <laughs> yeah. <I know. laughs> Pokey stars in Pokey's Punch Out, a tale of Pokey's rise in the boxing brackets to be the champ. <laughs> <laughs> Farmer, thank you so much for gifting Gailey Lame uh, as sub. And and Mad Deb, thank you so much for gifting the sub as well. Appreciate it so much, guys. It's so lovely of you guys. <laughs> Farmer again for MD MDJ. Thank you for gifting us up to MDJ. You know what? We should get Neary. Farmer's on a farmer's on a roll. Do you know what? We should get Neary. We should get Neary one of those um, one of those things that. Um, Slowly taking over that number one slot. Indeed, you are. We should get Neri one of those things that allows her to type with her chin, so that when her hands are sore, <laughs> she can um, she can still type. That's what we should do. I need one of those. Not sure your bank manager would like you competing. <laughs> Feel free to compete, though, Mad Deb. What do you think, Neri? And then, then you can just type with your chin. <laughs> You'd laugh tons. <laughs> no, no thanks. Uh, that would be so fun. Can't I unload my baler? You should be able to. I've got a dingleberry right at the back and it's bothering me. <laughs> you should be able to unload it. Have you done the um Have you done all those clicks, the the, the double shoulder thing and all that? It's this prize poop in the nappy just hanging out there. Yes, Use I your have. Foot. <laughs> Get a stinky pad and use your foot with a virtual keyboard. Google Google is a wonderful thing. Oh, I love Google. And I hate Siri as much as I love Google. Oh, Siri was listening to me then. <laughs> her, her phone's going to shut down now. <laughs> hey, did it work? I can actually be quite rude to Siri. Did it work, Farmer? I need to turn this down because I feel like I'm yelling. <laughs> I, I noticed when I'm when I'm recording YouTube videos, um, if I've got my headphones up too loud with the game. Uh, I noticed that I actually yell and I talk a lot louder. And then added, I've got to fix it. It was annoying, was it? Okay. Neary stars in the Chinna Pin. <laughs> a mystery for the ages as folks try to uncover how Neary types novels with just her chin. <laughs> oh, that is so awesome. Uh. I worked it out. I still had the bailer on. Ah, well there you go. Dingleberries are cleared. <laughs> how's, how's that how's that hokey pokey link to her um to her Facebook page and her art that um that Papa Ken did? <laughs> it's a crack up. 
I oh, know. Oh, my perfectly, my perfectly dumb bales. And I just hit them. Oh. <laughs> all, proce all proceeds go to keeping the real talent behind the stream happy. <laughs> I love how you pick on me so much for my OCD, but you with your bales is just... That was terrible. Oh. I think Neary's probably had a fit as well. That's why we can't have nice things. <laughs> <laughs> Got the horse pack for free, yeah. The horse the horse pack's not too bad. I, I um, before I went away, um, I got with my birthday money and stuff. I got um, I, I bought a uh, Nintendo Switch and uh, I got Farm Sim. Nintendo Switch Edition, which is basically the full version of Farm Sim 17 for like twelve dollars fifty. So I was sitting in the uh, I was sitting in the in the motel room at night playing that. <laughs> that. That was what I was doing while I was away when I wasn't working. I was just sitting there playing Farm Sim on uh, Nintendo Switch, and it's actually not too bad. It's not too bad at all. The horseback's pretty pretty cool. The horse packs a carryover from 17, so I was going to buy um, I was going to buy um, Farm Sim 20 on the Switch for while I was away, but it's like it's 69 dollars. It costs more on the Switch. Yeah, you see, that's a good idea too, farmer. I love I'm MDJ. I'm loving it. I'm actually really liking it. I'm doing a um. I'm doing a YouTube series on it as well, uh, as well as Hokey Pokey and I are playing it, so, which is pretty cool. It actually got me back into, uh, back into Farm Sim, because I haven't been playing it for quite a while, so, for a considerable amount of time. Yeah. The mods are okay on um, on PS4. You see, you're kind of limited on PS4 and stuff, aren't you? Because um, because you can only have a certain amount of slots and stuff. I don't understand the whole slot thing. The only thing with the uh, Nintendo Switch version is you can't put mods in it. It's devastating. You're stuck with the uh, with the basics of what you got. But I'm playing um, I'm playing a farm on Soznovka. Um, which is which was hokey pokey's and my favourite favourite as farm, so in seventeen. Although you liked um, hey memories. Yeah, memories of us farming together in that. What what DLC you bought this one? I think it's worth it, and I think the uh, extra equipment that you get and stuff um, with the DLC is really good. It's not like you're just getting a map, and this map's actually really nice. I actually really like this map. I mean, it's very, it's very giants this map, uh, as opposed to some of the other DLC maps that you get from mod makers. But, uh, but it's actually pretty cool. I don't mind it to be honest. Do not mind it at all. Yeah, you don't understand it either. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't understand it. I watch um, I watch a YouTuber who who plays um, who plays farm sim on console. That's all he does, uh, and that's pretty well a majority of what his YouTube channel is. And um, and he's always talking about slots and stuff. And I'm just like, oh, I have no idea, because I don't actually have it on. Um, I've got a PS4, but I don't actually have it on PS4, so. But you can't sort of kill yourself on it, do you know what I mean? Like, um, you can, you, you tend to, to overplay and stuff, and I think that's why Hokey Pokey and I stopped playing it for a while, because we actually overplayed it and killed the game for ourselves, so. Oh, I'm glad, Matt Deb, I'm, I'm so glad that you're enjoying the stream. Thank you so much. 
I need one black sheep in that pasture. Okay, just for you, just for you, my friend, I shall do that. <laughs> I, shall, one. I shall put one black sheep. But Hokey has all the black sheep. She's got all black and white sheep. So. Oh, they look fabulous. Right, here we go. This is the old uh, two-wheel drive Massey, this one. I love it. So, and that's the thing with uh, with the Switch version. You can't get mods like this, which means that um, some of the stuff I absolutely love, I can't uh, I can't have in it. So, need a moose on my farm? I, I can't get a moose. Let's just jump out of there for a sec. I do need something to clean, don't I? I'm gonna have to get a black sheep just for a uh, just for farmer. There we go. Uh, let's grab one of those and confirm that. All right, where is it now? Is it going to stand out in amongst all of these? Uh, ah, there it is. It's the black sheep of the family. It's like me. Oh. I was the black sheep of my family as well. So, one of my, <laughs> I put my, I put my fruit trees just on the inside of my um, my sheep field. Yeah. And uh, one of them just climbed on a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Is it still there? Yeah, it came back down again. Oh, it came down again. Yeah. yeah. I was going to come over and have a look at it. Uh, yeah. So what is your uh, what what is your favorite tractor? What's your favorite brand of tractor on this? What's your the Hokey Pokies is Dutz Far, isn't it, sweetie? It is. is still is it still Dutz Far? Yes. Yeah. I'm partial to New Holland's as well. Oh, come on, you did it again. No, 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 that's a boo boo. Damn it. Why, but I think I like the red tractors and equipment the least. Really? Yeah, maybe they're too... International. Yeah, llamas. Yeah, I wish they had llamas. They do have... Um, Farm Sim 17 had a goat mod where you could have goats. <laughs> Pokey's favourite tractor is the tractor beam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I kind of like Case as well. MDJ, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of the same, and the, and the internationals. I'll tell you what are, what are a really good mod. You've probably got them, farmer. I, I think we've got them in here. Uh, let me just save this properly. Otherwise, Hokey will go off at me. Tractors like watermelons. You keep the red and throw away the green. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, no, sorry. Out. <laughs> There we go. Uh, I think I've I think I've got them in here. Uh, medium. No, not there. Uh, small was it? Is it in small? Ah, oh, stop doing that. Bad dab. Here we go. Hello. Are you, are you using Naz's thing, sweetie? You're the goat of the family. Okay, oh, oh, look, I've missed two goat streams now. One for Christina, <coughs> which is right there, <laughs> and one for Mad Deb, who's going to freak out again. <coughs> you have been for about 10 minutes, sweetie. There we go, goat screams, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the goat screams. <laughs> See how popular they are, sweetie. That wonderful Father's Day present is just so popular. All right, let's go in here. Maybe it's because I feel like red clashes with yellow too much. <laughs> red clashes with yellow, you temperamental artist. <laughs> um, MX, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the channel and welcome to the family. You're starting to really love it, yeah. It doesn't take long to fall in love with it. 
You don't know how you're going to top it next year? No. How are you going to do that? I can't I can't find them. I don't have them in here. Actually, I just got this mod because I don't mind the old New Hollands as well. And I actually got this mod, and I'm thinking about giving this a go on this farm. It reminds you of a cartoon character, but you can't decide which. Homer in an episode. It does sound like Homer in an episode when he squeals like a girl. MX Scrinzy, how are you tonight? I hope you are well. Um, yeah. <laughs> Can we not cut down the fruit trees? You can't cut down fruit trees, no. How do I get rid of it? Sell them. Okay. You got to sell them. Um, yeah. So I'm thinking actually using this. I don't have the I don't have the tractors on that I was thinking of, farmer. Uh, I've got some um, some IH mods, some old international harvesters. Actually, if you go and have a look at my Pineapple Bay series on YouTube, you'll see one of, one of them in there. It's really awesome. Yeah, there's some good old Ford ones as well, MDJ. So, um, yeah, they did. They went to they went to New Holland, but they're still in in effect. They're still. Oh, I, didn't mean, I think they're still um, still Fords. Still forwards. Letter series mod. You could always request request one from somebody. When I when I was away this week, I seen that many tractors. I seen some um, some really old Fords sitting in tra in um, sitting in um, in uh, old sheds. Case, New Holland's seen too many John Deere's, way too many John Deere's in a lot of the sheds that I was in. Found the redeems. Ah, hydrate, there we go, thank you very much. I'm actually gonna, this is probably a week old, this water. Water time, water time, thank you very much, Mad Deb. Uh, nothing like a bit of stagnant water. <laughs> Hello, MX. Welcome to chat. Welcome. All right, let's uh, let's head down the store. I had a glass with you. Ah, excellent. You need to stay hydrated too, sweetie. I feel, I feel like I'm calling. I feel like I'm calling your boyfriend sweetie because you're using his account to chat. <laughs> and you won't know when they change back over. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. Oh, goodness me. All right, round we go. We're going to need to get a tether now. Uh, I, I guess they're relatively cheap, so we'll probably buy one. Golden Jubilee and then another 8N. Putting a flathead V8 in. You're going to have to post some more photos of these, I reckon. You should log into yours. Yes, you should, you lazy bum. <laughs> All right. Um, let me see. What am I doing? I'm, I'm, I'm having too much fun talking to you guys. Um, now we've got, uh, what have we got? These are from the Alpine Farming Pack, these tedders. So I'll sh show you what they are, but I won't get this one because I don't need anything this big. But this shed is lovely. Some of the, uh, Pottinger stuff, is that the, um, is that the one that came with the DLC? Yeah, the yeah. Alpine yep. one, yeah. Um, there's some, there's some quite nice Pottinger stuff in here as well. So that's the one that we are going to purchase. So we will grab that. Oh, I was going to say I can I can purchase a tether if you would like. I just purchased one. Do you have a grass field? Thanks for the offer. Uh, no, I only have a small piece of grass. So you could uh, you could buy this one off me if you want. A five star. Your your laptop ran out of charge, did it, darling? 
Oh, come on. Let's get in there. Let's get in there. Let's get in there. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. It might be too. Let's have a look. We'll, we'll have a look when we uh, when we unfold it. We'll have a squeeze. Is it a uh, Pottinger? Farmer? Whoa, watch the hedge. Watch the hedge, Simmy. There we go. Oh. Could someone um I do need to clean my windshields off. I don't have a uh, I don't have a spray thing. Could somebody um do a YouTube link, Mikey? Could you do uh, do a YouTube link for me, mate, please? Alright, there we go. I'll have a squid what what has she done with her? Oh, you don't know what brand yours is? Ah, oh, look at that. That's lovely. You put a big shed up behind there. Thank you very much, farmer. I appreciate it, mate. Jeez, Pokey's got it happening, hasn't she? All those orange trees. She probably hasn't put any water on them yet. <laughs> I have not. <laughs> it is a nice shed, isn't it? She only put that up because I have one exactly the same. Yeah, I'm just a copycat. Ah, uh, what am I doing? Stay out of my shed. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly right. Ah, oh, do you know what I did? I didn't. Um, I didn't speed up time. I, I left it on one. Uh, let's unfold the tether. That's five, isn't it? Uh, no, four. It's four. Let's turn him on, lower that, and off we go. This is probably going to throw all of this stuff into um, into my field, isn't it? Might be alright. Might be alright. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll check Discord, I'll check Discord for you. A sec. Okay. You'll have to let me know what you think of uh, what you think of the DLC. Don't let farmer see me backing, reversing the uh, reversing the tractor with the tether down. You'll have a fit. in stereo stereo that's exactly how you bend tines that's exactly right you should lift it like that yeah Mr. Sheepy it's also how you uh, kill sheep as well farming advice with Simi right around we go Bum, 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 bum. All right, off we go, up and downs, up and downs. So we'll get this out, and then we'll be able to uh, we'll be able to give our uh, sheep some more. Uh, our cab, our horses. I shall get it right. I shall get it right. We'll be able to give our horses some more. Um, some more food, so. Oops, I'm trying to pick up my bales with a uh, pallet fork. Oh, that, that actually does work. Just balance uh, on excellent. The mad dev, no worries. It was so good to see you, though. All right, here we go, just for you. Here's your goat stream. Thank you. Thank you very much for the... Uh, <laughs> for the redeems and thanks for uh, for coming back to the channel it's been nice to see you it's been lovely to see you in fact let us know how you go in uh, on the discord with the DLC 
Be safe. Bye. All right, straight through that sheep. Straight through that sheep there. Um, this is so. This is a mod. This sheep pasture is a mod. Uh, the animal pastures, where it uh, it just puts the stuff down there and then they roam around. But the um, but this mod actually has um, it has a field that you can cut in it. That's why, I'm, in case you're wondering why I'm driving through sheep, um, it was just for the sake of uh, cutting the grass because I need the grass. So there we go. I'm trying not to drive on the sheep. Yeah, it's a little bit hard when you're doing stuff like tedding and windrowing and stuff though. Mm. So... Could probably, um... Could probably not use this field, but I don't have any grass fields, so... Now, do you want any straw bales? Uh... Yeah, I'll, I'll buy um, I'll buy some off you. That would be awesome. Oh no, I'm going to get straw bales off them. No, it's all right, because I'm going to get straw bales off of uh, my oats. So oh, okay. That was before I uh, before I decided to grow oats. Oh, I shouldn't have made straw bales then. Uh, you'd sell them all off, can't you? Yeah, I guess so. I probably would have just collected the straw. Okay. But um, yeah, I'll just store a couple of them and sell them. I'm used to, I'm so used to, this is uh, the first tedding that I've done since uh, since playing on Seasons. And I'm so used to uh, having to ted, watch the weather and uh, wait for days for it to dry out. Or it's, it's time for me to go and get my coffee as well, I think. <laughs> yeah, well we're going to do some, uh, we're probably going to do some harvesting soon. Christina, that's that's relatively uh, that's relatively soothing as well. So, but it is a bit of a. Ah, uh, uh, you have yours already. I've gone against my. I've gone against my. Um, uh, nice. See what Mikey did for you there, farmer. I'm going against my streaming policy. I've been streaming for an hour and a half now, and I haven't, um, I haven't stopped for a quick break and uh, and to get a coffee. So I'm going to have to stop for a break in a sec. Are you going to keep going, hokey pokey? Should I, uh, if I stop for a break, should I, um, should I uh, go and stand over and watch what you're doing so everybody can see what you're doing? Um, I probably should go to bed soon, so should I? No, you don't have should to I go do now. so now? No. No. Have you got anything that, uh, that's going to be a problem if I keep playing on this, or...? Uh, sh no, I shouldn't like do. Your weeds no. have been sprayed and stuff, haven't they? Uh, I've got a field that is I've just harvested, so I just leave it like that. Yep. And and yeah, I sprayed the grass. I haven't fertilised. I should fertilise. Should fertilise. Need some smaller sheds. Um. Other smaller sheds. Ah, uh, it might be because. It might, uh, you know, what? it might be because um, it might be because uh, Nightbot with those commands has to be subscribed to the channel. So Nightbot's subscription to the channel might have run out. Farmer, I reckon that's probably why. I reckon that's why. Nightbot, uh, yeah, because Nightbot has to be subbed to the channel. <laughs> 
<laughs> thank you. There we go. That's that's kind of not what I meant, but thank you. <laughs> Thanks, mate. I think um, I think the pup again normally does that. Now I've got a question for you. If you had a tether that's like this that you could fold up, farmer. When <laughs> oh wow, goodness me, you did too. Wow, thank you. Um, where? Now I'm stumped for words. <gasps> yeah, I was going to ask you, farmer, if you had a tether like this that you could fold up, or, or if your tether does fold up, do you store it folded or do you store it open? And only uh, and only have it folded if you're uh, transporting it along the road and stuff. You store yours folded? Okay, excellent. That's all I needed to know. And you'd probably store yours in a shed, wouldn't you? I'm storing all of my equipment in the open. I probably need to put these cedars in a shed, though. There we go. Alright, there, there goes the train. Rail would be so upset. I can't find where the bail um, back for this truck is uh, it's the f oh it's got to be in there somewhere it's got to be in there somewhere look at that isn't it it's, it's such a nice view so uh, fold back and all wheels are still on the ground okay I think this one has two wheels up doesn't it yeah it does it has two wheels up and two on the ground G'day Oxy, how you doing mate? Uh, I am from um, I am from Australia, from South Australia actually. How are you and welcome to chat. It almost makes up for the lack of travel this year, yeah, travelling to uh, travelling to the Swiss Alps. Go and see what Hokey's up to. How are you Oxy? All right, so the corn's doing all right. Everything's uh, fertilized. Everything's fertilized here as well. On our canola, doesn't look awesome. I know somebody who did an entire um, entire map in FS seventeen with uh, uh, with canola, and it all uh, it all went yellow and flowered all at the same time. It looked so cool. I am awesome, thank you very much. I am awesome. I haven't had a uh, chance, Oxy, to, to stream for a week because I've been away, so it's, been, it's really nice to get back to streaming and to see everybody in the community again. Well, that's going to do the hydraulics really well, Hokey. What's that? Oh. <laughs> I'm prepared. Pre-prepared. A little bit early before I even bought the truck. <laughs> so those of you that can uh, send uh, send Oxy a, a cup of coffee if you can. Everybody send Oxy a cup of coffee. All right. Uh, yeah. Well, well, bales, bales, bales. Oh, you got a? Have you got a grass bale sitting over here? Oh, it would have been emptied. Yeah, I got a couple of random ones. <laughs> Thanks, farmer. There you go. <laughs> Thanks, Oxy. <laughs> yeah, it's nice. It's nice to be back. Thank you, Mikey. Thank you, Gailey Lame. Everybody's sending. Uh, yeah, everybody's sending Oxy a coffee. Thanks, I'm Christina. Just say coffee emoji. Coffee emoji. Coffee emoji to you, Oxy. <laughs> yes, you can't do it. Oh, you could. You could. Ah, oh, look, here she comes in her new truck. Look, she's bought herself a new truck. This is one of your most favourite mods, isn't it? Hokey. This truck? Yeah. Yeah, it looks so tiny now. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Huh? Looks tiny with that massive bale there. Just in case T, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Uh... 
It's it's very you this truck, but it is definitely one of your most favourite, isn't it? Yeah, I wish I'd painted it the colours I normally do though. I just try and do something different. I'm going with the, the oh, with the whole theme, class theme. <laughs> now you're gonna watch my my dodgy. <laughs> They all loading. I'll, I'll I'll check it out. Um, I'm gonna I'm just gonna run and make myself a cup of coffee. But instead of going to the be back soon screen, I'm actually gonna um, leave Hokey Pokey talking to you, and you can watch her stack. So keep stacking from this side, Hokey. Okay. <laughs> I'll be, I'll be. I think I'm only gonna. What am I gonna get on there? Six. Oh yeah. I need to go to bed after. M maybe a two. few more. Maybe a few more. All right, guys. Um, I will be back in a sec, but I'll leave it on this so that you can uh, so that you can watch <laughs> so you can watch Hokey loading bales, which should be exciting. Um, so, sorry to to uh, just disappear for a couple of minutes on your oxy when you just uh, when you just joined chat, but I'll, I'll be back in a sec. Oh, don't say that. I don't do talking well. I'll just be really entertaining with this stacking. <laughs> Very entertaining. I'm definitely not a professional talker. -er. Bad. <laughs> Thanks, Christina. Family. We are married. Happily married at that. I'm going to fit this in here. Have to wedge it in from the other side. <laughs> All right, watch this trick. Watch it from the top. Ah, or That normally works. <laughs> Is that a trick you can do, farmer? In real life? Yes. Winning. <laughs> Shimmy it in. <laughs> exactly. Right, how many more am I going to fit on another another row? Or do I just keep piling higher and higher?
Well, jumping on it does sound like a lot of fun. Too sure my game character would be capable. Good evening, Lana. I've been left on my lonesome for the moment. This side. Look at this almost brilliant job I'm doing. So I need a full report, everybody. I need a full report. <gasps> the banana! <laughs> the banana <laughs> is Thank here. You. Thank you, farmer. That's how you do it on the farm. Excellent. Masterclass. <laughs> we shimmied it in. Time. She is a pro. She's a, she's a good farmer. She was the one that got me into this game in the first place. In the old 17 days. In the old 17 days. Let's check it out. Are you still there, uh, are you still there daughter? You are? They're, um, they've just they've announced the release of Sims 5. You know, Sims 5's coming out soon. Look at that. Look at her go. Jealous, aren't you? I'm very jealous. The farmer's going to be offering you a job soon. Excellent. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might be excited about Sims 5. Beautiful work. Is there any more? Or is that it? No, there's a, there's a few. Quite a few here. Doing a good job. What do you reckon? Do you reckon she should go another stack? It would be one heck of a commute. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, goodness With my driving, I don't know if that's a bit too dangerous. Yes, uh, but I'm probably going to do it anyway. We drive a tractor to work. If it fits, it ships. <laughs> there you go. There's some professional farming advice for you, honey. Mm -hmm. If it ships, it fits. <laughs> if it fits, it ships. Yeah. Look at that. Look at her go. Those Swiss Alps there. Bit of snow up on the on the peaks there. I kind of wish our little farm spots here just had a slight amount of hills to them. Oh, there are. I'm pretty sure there. I think there there's fields that have hills on them. I'm not sure. It's I know there's big grass here. ones. It is pretty flat, isn't it? Yeah. You could make hills. I could. That sounds expensive. Yes, I would have rode, loaded it from the rear instead of the side as well. Well, that's Farmer. a bit. She's thinking about it. <laughs> she's, she's thinking about it. I'm here now. There we go. <laughs> uh, perfect. Perfect job. Oh. Do I line it up with the uh, top layer that's already wonky, or do I line it up properly? I don't know. 
Don't walk behind Hokey when she's driving a tractor. Look at that. There you go. That is a, that is actually an awesome truck, isn't it? <laughs> I love it. It's got straps, hasn't it? Right. Uh, yes. I was just checking that. Doesn't, doesn't it's not showing straps? There oh yeah. There we go. Oh, flashlight. <laughs> just uh, just uh, levitating hokey. <laughs> So funny! It's so funny how they've done the walk animation in this. I'm gonna shimmy that one in because it's just gonna bother me. Done. There we go. Do you want me to do the uh, strap up? Yes, please. Can't find a strap. Can you? Oh, there it is. Uh, oh, that's the light. No, I just jumped in. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not using my controller. Thief. Not using my controller. All right. There you go. Object too heavy. <laughs> it's it's right near the end, I think. Got it. So. All right. So what are we up to? We've got uh, our core. Everything's everything's going all right there. The horses. Are, I'm I'm wondering how much it's going to cost us tonight for these horses. What is it? Is it what is it? Is it about two hundred dollars per horse or something? Farmer, need to uh, row this stuff, so we'll jump in here. Thought you had a unicorn in there for a second. Maybe I do. Maybe I do. Uh, where's my rower with? gone? It's over there. Oh, I can't. I can't row on this tractor. Actually, I forgot I can't row on this tractor. Sure. What I can do though. So I can uh, go over here. Bullfrog's dis disgusted with the state of my windows. Oh, there we go. Grab that. Turn him off. Go and grab this fella here. Don't think we've got any more. We've got no more spraying to do this this uh, season as well. So probably change these uh, tires over. Change these wheels over. Right. Uh, let's do that and go back to standard tires. There nice train line. I know. Runs directly behind my shed. Oh, and you got the river there. Nice. 300 per horse per day. Uh, considering the amount of profit that you make on them, that's probably not too bad, really, is it? When you think about it. When you're selling your horses for 50 grand. <laughs> you're driving through fences. <laughs> I'm just driving through your fence. <laughs> I got lost. It's a right swath. It's making a right swath. So this is my rower. This is my wind rower. Alright. That's what I was wondering. I was wondering whether it actually would turn a profit or not. Whether it had, uh, whether it had eat too much into it, but three hundred dollars a day. How many days does it take for the horses to? Um... Yeah, it is pretty fancy, isn't it? How are you, banana? How are you doing in the heat? Because it's uh, it's pretty warm. This thing won't work. Uh, won't work backwards. It has to go forwards, no matter what. So, ten days to train a horse. So that's three grand per horse. 
That's not too bad at all, is it really, when you think about it? Three grand per horse to have a helper run them, when you consider how much, how much time it takes you to do it when you do it yourself. Been making face masks, uh, face masks, have you? Are you selling them, or are you just making them for friends? I was lucky. I wasn't sure whether I was going to get back from New South Wales or not this week. A cool bit of uh, bit of profit there. When do they start work on all your stuff? Like your bathroom and stuff. Semidium face masks. <laughs> there we go. It's a good idea, Sack. <laughs> with my with my logo over over your, over the mouth over the mouth section, that'd be a good one. Should sell coffee, simmy coffee. That's it. A, uh, a, um, a, a semi coffee blend. Actually, I was considering buying a uh, coffee, uh, a rotisserie for the barbecue to, um, to roast our own coffee beans and make our own mixes. That would be pretty cool. I'd drink that. I reckon I could make a really nice mix of, a uh, really nice coffee mix, I reckon. Uh, let's see, let's, I think I might do a, uh, I think I might do a run this way, I reckon. I'm usually a really messy, uh, I'm really, uh, usually a really messy, um, wind rower. So. I do apologise. You are. Uh, quite a few are from the States. Are you, are you from the States, Oxy? Got quite a few from the States. Actually, a majority. I think a majority of my uh, a majority of my followers are from the states. Sack's not from the states. He's a Kiwi, so you don't need to worry about him. He's a Kiwi. All right, straight through all these sheep. Cringing. Christina's cringing now. Wow, that's a lot of sewing. <laughs> you only drink beer. <laughs> a look. Another th wow, that's that's a lot of face masks. Are they uh they'd be difficult to make too, wouldn't they, banana? Oh yeah, we're all coffee people here. We are, most of us are coffee people, but the bananas um she's uh she's a tea drinker. She loves her tea. Which is fine. Two days non stop. Wow. She's fine. Which is which is um where whereabouts are you from, Oxy then? Whereabouts are you from, mate? What part of the States? Oh, 
You know, the one, one thing that I like about uh, playing farm sim with a controller instead of my steering wheel and joystick and everything is I can actually lay back and relax. Did you do work on towers over there, farmer? California? <laughs> yeah, your housemates doing all the cutouts and stuff. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, make them, make them work. Make them work. Uh, what's going on? Trying to figure out what's going on here. It's a good production line, it would be. Did you uh, did you click follow Oxy uh, while I was gone? Because uh, if you did, thank you very much. It won't let me send a whisper for some reason. Do, 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 do. I don't know why. Or is it doing it? It might be doing it. Who knows? Keeping my little dirt dot in the middle of the field. That I accidentally painted. <laughs> what did you do? I'm keeping my little dirt dot, but I just uh, I, I fixed up the edges of it so it's a bit more organic. Ah. Uh. You now it's a feature. Oh, stretch, stretch. I don't know why I don't, I don't know why it didn't let me uh, I, I got um, <laughs> Qantas Qantas were um, Qantas were giving out face masks like you could take them from a little box uh, as you went to board the plane <laughs> And I, I kept grabbing them. I came home with about, um, I came home with about ten, I reckon, banana. <laughs> it's this son of a, how you doing? How are you? Nice to see you. Welcome back. Yeah, so I was every time I got on a plane, which is quite often, uh, I was I was just grabbing, I was grabbing a handful of them. When I got on a plane in Wagga, um, I grabbed like, I think four of them. Um, then when I got in on Sydney, in Sydney, I grabbed another, uh, I think I grabbed another five or six of them. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Will definitely. Might grab one for uh might grab one for the daughter, I reckon. She really should be wearing one all the time. Yes, your father is speaking. Your father is speaking, gaily lame. Oh you have lots, do you? Cool. Okay, there we go, got that one. Uh, let's get this one here. What are you up to, son of a? What is that noise? Oh, I just hit the uh, I just hit the pipe work. Plumber won't be happy. Plumber won't be happy. Mighty Hulk. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome. Rather they go to people that really need it. Yeah, you're a sweetie. 
All right, farmer, no worries, mate. Got to drive for an hour to the coffee shop. Really? That's dedication. Here's to you, my friend. That is absolute dedication. All right, I'll see if it'll allow me. Oxy. Okay, sweetie. See you when you get back. Right. Just waking up at 7.25 a.m. That's early. Uh, let me see. Let's just uh, line ourselves up here. I actually really like this rower. I think this is this came with the... Uh, this actually came with the DLC, this one, so... I don't mind it. I'm not usually one for, uh, but I don't normally like, um, rowers that row to one side. I like them that row, I like the ones that row into the center, but this one actually isn't too bad, to be honest. It's working good. Let me see, Oxy. Let me see if it, if it works or not. No, it's not doing anything. Why isn't it doing anything? To go get chocolate ice cream. Oh, we've got some chocolate ice cream. We have chocolate ice cream. I don't know why it's. Uh, I don't know why it's not doing that. Let me just we check. We only have the one water station thing. We don't have any mods. Uh, do we have the standpipe on or not? I mightn't have. I mightn't have um, enabled that one. It, it won't work, Oxy. Sorry. For some reason, I don't know why. I'm trying. You have to muster up the energy. Chocolate ice cream. It's worth it. <laughs> I, I, I tend to break lots of things. I tend to break lots of things, MD. Alright, there we go. That's that. So now we just need to uh, bail it, so. Alright, beautiful. Let's go and get the, uh, let's go and get the baler. I think we'll put some, uh, we'll put some bales straight into, um. But bed is comfy, yes. Bed is always comfy. But again... Like uh, Hokey said, it is chocolate ice cream banana. Not chocolate banana ice cream, chocolate ice cream banana. Alright, let's see what we've got. We should uh, we should have quite a few bales out of this actually. I reckon. Yeah, did it work? Did it work? Got nothing. I've got nothing come up. I do make a solid point. Oh, Hokey makes a solid point. Aha! There we go. So hard to go to bed when we're playing this. It is. It There's is. Too much to do. So, um, the question is: Do you keep playing and suffer tomorrow, or for the fun of it? No, I need to. Uh, I need to water these trees. Is my plan now? Uh, no, it's picked up as grass because of um, it's picked up as grass because of my last uh, my last field. Although I'm positive that I emptied. Maybe okay. it picked up a piece of grass initially. That's okay. Showing posts now where um, my sheep pastures. Uh, I'll check it out, son of a. I will check it out. And I need to check out um, farmers. I need to check out the AFK farmer's uh, picture that he posted. Let's see. Ah, okay, cool. So that folds out the other way. Nice. Nice masks, Mrs. Mod. Very nice masks. Let me have a look. Is that one with buttons on it? There's a whole pile of buttons on it. They're like pictures of buttons. 
because uh, if it is, Hokey will be quite impressed with that. Geez, they worked really well too. They look great. They do. A couple of happy recipients. I've got to bring Quitter up. Hey, Mad Deb. You're not blocked. Welcome to the. Uh, welcome to the. Um, Welcome to the Discord. Alright, now I've got to bring Twitter up as well. Let's see. Dangerous to go alone. Take this. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's a good one. I'll send a follow through. I'll send a follow through to you. There we go. Your cat's hungry. Oxy's cat's hungry. You can't have an angry. A uh, hungry cat's an angry cat. All right. Let's try. Let's try and get this bale out. It's going to come out as grass, which is a, a little bit annoying. Because I've got enough grass bales, but I must have picked up a piece of grass first. There we go. Might as well just grab all of this stuff here as well. Now that I've got water, I might as well buy the chickens. I'm never going to get to bed. You don't need to go to bed. You need to keep farming. Alright, up we go here. It's actually not picking up as much grass as I thought it would. I think I got what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bales. I reckon I got eight bales off of this area last time. That's, uh, we need manure as well, don't we? Ah, uh, for the trees. They'll Please. they'll still. Yeah. They Do will we have still. Uh, buying thing. Uh, we don't have that mob, but we can put it on. They Those will still grow, yeah. but you'll just get like less. You'll get a less um, less production from it. So less production. All right, here we go. get in here uh, let's uh, unload the bale straw oh, bum don't let Hokie see that All right now I've got to make sure that I get a, a bit of hay first there we go perfect Just uh, run this out here. This is a pretty cool little baler. This baler is a mod as well. If we go, see, we didn't go right up there and. Uh, I forgot to row up there as well. Look out, sheepy. Look out, sheepy. That's uh, not our land. Buttons, banana. Did you get out of bed and get your ice cream? going to do is I'm going to uh, I'm going to turn that off and I'm going to run this straight over and drop it straight in the food over here I think because these horses still need quite a bit of food so I'll 
probably just roll it there. Straight in should be okay, I reckon. Sweet, 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 sweet bit of coffee. I had to throw the bit a bit in. Bit a bit. Okay, uh, let's see. This is where um, some of these uh, these four wheel steer tractors that you've got in uh, in the new DLC here are really, really cool when you're doing stuff like baling and uh, and mowing. Because they, they basically turn on a dime. They're awesome. They're really, really cool. How are you going over there, Hokey? Good. I <coughs> gave the chickens some water. Got chickens. And now I'm going to give them some food. Yes, that will help. Whoops. Thanks, Mikey. I'm not sure how many bales we can actually throw in there at this point in time. Uh, let's have a look at where we're at now. What have we got? Uh... Yeah, we can put heaps in. We'll probably put the whole lot in, I reckon. Oh, I think our oats just popped. Look. Uh, don't tell me that they just popped and... No, they didn't. It's alright. I'm looking at next door's field. I'm going to make some oats for Bracky tomorrow, too. Oats. Are you a horse? Yes. Have you not noticed? No. Ah, uh, it's so nice. Coffee is such a thing. Such a thing. <laughs> All right, in we go. Let's do a little bit of uh, first personage. A little bit of first personage. There's our black sheep that farmer wanted. Come on, black sheep, get out of the way. Where's my horn? Oh. Don't know whether you guys can hear. I think the sheep just morphed through. And got sucked into the. Uh, got sucked into the front of the tractor. <clears throat> Why won't you attach? Alright. I think we've got scraggly bits to pick up over here. We do. You're a scraggly bit. I am a scraggly bit. I'm well known for being a scraggly bit. Oh. So I'm, I'm guessing that we're going to get pretty close to um, pretty close to this actually all of these bales actually going into um, going into the horses I reckon so but it'll definitely tide them over until um, until the uh, until the oats come in so there we go Let's move back a little there. So I think we've put uh, three bales in now, haven't we? So what's that? Uh, what's that telling us? Yeah, quite a bit. Going to need quite a bit. Look at that! The grass just popped again. Got it on slow as well. Oh no, it didn't. It was just uh, it was just texture popping pretty well. <laughs> the sheep keep popping in and out as well. 
All right, spin around here. <laughs> they were just running in front of me. There's no thought for their safety at all. So for those of you that uh, that, that play this yourselves, do you? Um, for those of you that are watching that play this yourselves, do you? Um, do you play with a controller or do you play naughty sheeps exactly or do you play with a uh, steering wheel and stuff because I always uh, used to play with the steering wheel all the time but um, I think I got a little bit lazy I think I got very lazy in fact and Hokie used to play with the steering wheel all the time as well good I need the bum to set it up though have other setups. <laughs> yeah, that's what I find as well. I am going to bail, pun intended, and go to bed. That was a pretty good pun, actually. Thank you. I think if Papa Ken was here, he'd be proud of you for that pun. <laughs> he would be absolutely and utterly proud of you. We'll have to let him know that you did that. It took me ages to come up with that one. Because Lobethal, yeah, okay, really? Wow. Completely totaled it, hey? It's a good one, though. It was a good one, Hokey. Well, they're pretty big. They're pretty big. At, uh, hitting a cow would be worse than hitting a roo. And hitting a roo is pretty terrible, so... Oh, I'm going to hit that trailer. Oh, don't do that. There we go. Uh, I was going to ask that next. What's that? Well, the cow lived. Oh, really? Wow. Thank you, Lana. <laughs> He's so proud of you. <laughs> Nighty night. Uh, should also live through. Wow. It's a tough cow. <laughs> very, very tough cow. Indeed. Uh, come and say good night. Ah, stretchy, stretchy. Show off your Christmas top. <laughs> she's, good. she's wearing a Christmas top. It's <laughs> wearing a Christmas top. Hang on a sec. Let me go up there. Believe in magic. Believe in magic. Mm. There we go. <laughs> Don't tell anyone that you're wearing a Christmas top. That I just bumped the microphone. Oh, that you just bumped the microphone. Yeah, that was that was a mother said. Her hair's made of fire, it is indeed. So is her heart, <laughs> Captain Bullfrog, and her attitude. <laughs> Desperately needs refiring. Yeah, I know, it's pretty, pretty bare. It would have been pretty bare, Lana, I reckon. So, pretty bare indeed. No, it's fine, it is fine. Oh. Night. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Good night, darling. I love you. Good night, everyone. I'm just going to take a really quick break, guys. I'll be back in a sec. I should be back in a sec.
Alrighty then. We are back. Back. She's off. She's off. We have to do a run up the side of this field as well, I think. Right up the side of this field and back again. I don't want to destroy my crops though. There's a little bit of weed down the side of those crops. Or is that actually on the, might actually be on the grass on the edge because I sprayed all of that, so should be all right. Hopefully I'm not destroying crops. Real talent behind the stream, she is. Did you expect that to happen when you did that, Christina? Yeah, uh, you got your chocolate ice cream. <laughs> there you go. See, it was worth the trip, wasn't it? It was worth jumping out of a comfy bed for. Wasn't it, banana? Now I feel like chocolate ice cream. Gonna have to have some when the stream ends. When the stream ends. Ah, oh, we good nearly got another full bale out of this. That's pretty cool. I wasn't expecting that. There we go. Lift that up. We'll go and drop this one off as well. There we go. Look at Mr. Sheepy eating that little patch of grass there. Yeah, I'm glad I was able to get home as well, I can tell you. Um, that other bale didn't seem to go in for some reason. Let's see if we can push it in. I was actually a little, I was a little bit worried. We were supposed to fly back in. Um, we were supposed to fly in from Canberra on, uh, on Friday morning. We ended up getting a flight from Wagga Wagga to um, up to Sydney on Thursday night, and then um, and then flying in from there, flying back to Adelaide on Thursday night from Sydney. So, come on, come on, there we go, perfect. So we we're kind of lucky. I was a bit worried that I wasn't going to get home. All right, we'll go and pick the rest of this stuff up now. Should be okay. Oh, I am not sitting very comfortably tonight in here. Uh, let's see, turn that on, lower that. Just grab these little straggly bits here as well. Try not to kill any sheep. Last plane out of Sydney's almost gone, yeah. It almost was, but I tell you, the uh, the amount of times that we got stopped by police and airport staff and stuff like that the whole time was incredible. And getting calls from uh, New South Wales Health all the time as well. Um, just non-stop, so the whole time we were over there. But like so many calls from uh, New South Wales Health and stuff asking where we've been and whether we've been to any of these uh, any of these places, like any of the areas. We are we just had a we just had another outbreak, Tony, uh, in South Australia, so. How is that guy lying though, Banana? <laughs> the guy, the guy, one of the guys lied to the contact tracers and it caused a uh, six day shutdown in South Australia because of what he said and, and what he said was a lie and there was no need for a shutdown. So <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Like just absolutely and utterly mad. Somebody to lie to the contact traces. 
Second phase, yeah. Second phase. All right, let's get that in there. All packed away for next time. There we go. Disconnect it. Beautiful. Perfect. Yeah, not that he was working at the pizza bar, so they thought it had um, it had transferred because of a delivery, which made it even worse. It was shocking. Uh, all right, so how are these guys going? Let's have a look. Uh, let's see, what are we looking for? <laughs> We've got one black sheep, <laughs> black sheep of the family. Okay, so uh, so we need to rename the rest of these horses. Let's see, we've got a fair bit of hay in there. Um, water and straw is okay. Everything's good. So uh, let's name this horse. Has anybody got any suggestions? Yeah, $400 million because all the businesses had to shut down and everything. It's not it's not too bad, actually, to be honest, Oxy, um, because uh, just because this person lied, uh, it's, it's not actually as bad as, as what it was when they lied. So, all right. I'm not wearing my uh, I'm not wearing my semi top tonight, Lena. Sorry. All right, so what are we going to name this horse, guys? We need some name suggestions. Sylvester Stallion. <laughs> okay. She, all right, Sylvester Stallion for this one. Let's rename him. Um, let's see. Sylvester Stallion. There we go. Ah, oh, there's not enough room. Sorry, there's not enough room. We need another one. Mocker babe. <laughs> Mocker babe. There you go. Mocker babe. All right, we'll confirm that one. Uh, Inferno. Okay, we need to rename this one. Uh, more names, more names. So Neary's come up with a name. Her milky and chocolate colours, yeah. <laughs> this that makes sense. It makes sense. Um, so Neary's come up with a name. Oxy's come up with a name. Uh, Sack, you need to redo your Sylvester Stallion because it didn't fit. So we need it. We need another one for it. Any other suggestions? Come on, banana. You're full of names. You're full of names. Mm, I'm not very good at naming uh, at naming horses. Rick Astley. <laughs> oh, serious? Seriously? I haven't heard that name for a long time. Rick Astley. <laughs> I can't believe we called it. <laughs> a horse Rick, Rick Astley. Oh no. <laughs> who calls who calls their horse Jimbo? Seriously. <laughs> hey A horse with no name. It won't fit in. Okay, hang on a sec. Hey you doing goof? Thanks for the uh resub mate. Thank you so much. Six months. Six months, goof. No name, there we go. Horse with no name. Pony Abbott. <laughs> okay, let's see. Which one can be Pony Abbott? It's that one. No, groovy, all right. Okay, Pony Abbott. Yeah, all's, all's good, mate. All's good, thank you. It's good now I'm home. Pony Abbott. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, there you go. That's a good one. 
That's a need. <laughs> yeah, it's good to see you though, Goof, our resident uh, work light. It's very he's only come back because I um because I played Gold Brush. All right, Black Horse. What are we gonna call the Black Horse? We're gonna come up with a name for the Black Horse. I used to, uh, dog food. <laughs> All right. Hope, hope, uh, hope Gailey Lame hasn't seen that one. Glue stick. All right. Glue stick. Ursula can be called glue stick. You're back, farmer. Glue stick. I used to name all my horses after Tom Waits characters and songs. Bessie, Milan, Mulan, Mulan. We've got one more to rename. All right, we'll rename this one. Mulan. So there we go. We've got Tito, which uh, <laughs> which it wouldn't let us do because it had tit in it. Uh, Mocha Babe, Rick, <laughs> Rick Astley, No Name, Pony Abbott, Dog Food, Glue Stick, and Mulan. Perfect, guys. Perfect. What are you up to, Goof? What are you up to, mate? <laughs> All right, horses are named. What have we got here? Uh, let's see. Growth. So we are at the final stage of growth on those two runs there. Excellent. Look at all Hokey Pokey's stuff at the... Uh, <laughs> oh no, that would that would be the forklift and the uh, and the lime thing. All right, I've got a I've got a load of uh, I've got a load of corn sitting here as well. Ah, right, cool, just hanging, just chilling, mate, just chilling. Uh, what have we got? I've got a load of corn. But uh, corn, no, corn's not selling for a very good price at the moment. It's selling for an average price. So we'll wait until that price goes up. How have you been, Goof? Thank you very much for all the... Um, thank you very much for all of the uh, comments and stuff on YouTube. Appreciate it very much, mate. Your friend's little one's first birthday today. I remember. I remember ours. Ours. Ours first birthday. Field five. Should we do a cultivating job? Push to tomorrow. Well, it can. It can happen tomorrow now, can't it? So. Yeah, we're going to do that. All right. Beautiful. So let's go. Let's go here. Oh no, crap. I made the mistake. Oh, that's all right. That's okay. We can, uh, oh, we're in Hokie's tractor. We can actually take our tractor out to do the cultivating. I don't have a very big cultivator, but that's okay. Better than cancelled entirely, indeed it is. <laughs> they are always fun. They are always fun. They're fun when Hokie's around, organising them. She's awesome at that stuff. She's too creative. So creative. All right, let's see if we can grab that. So there's our cultivator. <laughs> You're getting old. <laughs> We're all getting old. We are all getting old, mate. Oh, we'll grab that as well. Uh, we should check our sheep, actually, before we... So we're going to field five to cultivate. Our sheep are fine. Sheep are fine. Where is, where is field five, actually? Uh, let's see. Field five is all the way up there. Of course it is. 
all the way up there. Okay, we can go there. <laughs> it does look like a line on the pregnancy test. Uh, we're just going to cut through the fence right here. Put on some, uh, put on some hazard lights, and off we go. Off we go. <laughs> they have no idea. They have no. Idea. Some parents spend like thousands of dollars on their kids' first birthday parties. Around we go. Whoop. Oh, controller sensitivity there. We're going to have a second birthday next March, a second birthday party. Which is going to be interesting. We did our Christmas tree today. All right, down we go. Actually, we nearly bought this field there and the other one over the other side here when we started this map, Hokey and I. But we didn't end up doing it. Well, that's our field right there. Let's reverse. There we go. All right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, when we had our puppy, she used to love the Christmas tree. She loved the Christmas tree. Flixo, <laughs> Flixo Tish, <laughs> Flixo Tish, thank you very much for the follow. I hope I got that right. I do hope I got that right. Uh, let's see, what am I doing? I'm doing that one. Come on. Oh, I'm lifting the weight, that's why. All right. Yeah, thank you for the follow and welcome to the channel. Uh, it was it was number five we were doing, wasn't it? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. You'd have to be careful of that stuff, wouldn't you? Our contract that we were doing was number five, wasn't it? Didn't we have a contract? We've got field six. I hope the contracts aren't uh, bummed out. Let's accept that one. Uh, field six we can do while we're here. That's active now. Okay. I don't know why it did that. It was five, wasn't it? Must have pressed the wrong button or something. Uh, I probably pressed the wrong button on uh, the controller because I think I did it with the controller. So this is field six. This one will be easy enough. Won't take us long to do. It's only worth 720 bucks. Rail, Rail's here. Oh, so everybody, that's the uh, end of the stream. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I did that to you last time, didn't I, Rail? How you doing, mate? Have you started the new job yet? Yeah, I thought it worked. I thought it, I thought we had it right. Do you know what I found? You can do uh, you can do big harvesting like potato harvesting contracts and stuff, and you can use um, you can use hired workers to do them, and you still make profit. You've still got to run the you've still got to do the running between the harvester and the uh, and the sale point, but you can make quite a bit of money from them. I'm not going anywhere, Cap. I was just staring up rail. How how'd it go? How'd it go, Rail? How'd the new job go? Is it good, mate? Yeah, I was only stirring Rail up, Cap. I think last time, uh, last time he showed up, I was just finishing up the stream. So, 
but I uh, haven't seen you guys for for a week, so I don't want to. I don't want to finish my stream up at all. Okay, what time is it? It's uh, three twenty eight p.m. in game. Not in real life. What time is it in real life? It's uh, 11.40. 11.40 p.m. Feels like oh, ages ago that I streamed last banana. It does. It does. How's um? How's Papa Ken? Is he doing all right? Have you been? Have you been speaking to him? Ah, that's pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. That makes it that makes it nice, Rail. I'm glad it's going all right, mate. I'm very glad that it's going all right. Yeah, it was afternoon already. <laughs> it was the chocolate ice cream banana. Ah, uh, you'll learn easily enough. Just keep all of your receipts, mate, and keep all of your uh, all of your job payment receipts and all that type of stuff. Make sure you have every absolutely everything, and um, and you should be okay. I'm not sure exactly how you how you do your taxes over in the states, but pretty sure you've got to keep hold of those and you've got to keep hold of them for uh, for quite a long time don't just uh, don't just get rid of them straight away after you've done your tax you need to keep them as records you haven't heard from him I hope he's all right he posted he posted that thing in the uh, in the mod thing saying that he missed me when am I coming back? And I responded, and he didn't respond. I hope he's okay. What, tax is way more confusing in the US, you reckon? I'm a bit worried about him now. Very concerned. Right. This shouldn't take too long to do. Jimmy, how you doing, buddy? How are you over there? I've been worried about you too. Been worried about you and Joe. Is everything going all right over there, mate? Yeah, it's just a bit of a worry when you haven't heard from him and when he doesn't respond to uh, when he doesn't respond to to something on Discord. Goof, it's it's kind of unlike him. So, and we know how tough things are over there as well. Search party for Papa Ken. Yeah, send out the search party. Ah, uh, thanks, banana. Everything's fine. Back to work. Oh, excellent. Um, yeah, I'm good, mate. I've been away for a week. I've been touring New South Wales doing servicing and stuff, and uh, I was a little bit worried because we had another outbreak here and um, in South Australia, and I was a bit worried that I wouldn't get back into the state because the state went into lockdown. So <laughs> that's a good one, Raoul. Um, so yeah, I was a bit worried, Jimmy, but um, but I managed to get home thankfully. Uh, Three point five days, yeah. There, look, look, Rail. There's a train, mate. There's a train. 
Yeah, we are. There was a bit of a there was a bit of a scam on that uh, on that uh, lockdown and stuff, James. But they um, but they cut it short. So at midnight tonight, which is in about fifteen minutes, um, the, uh, the the restrictions, a lot of the restrictions lift. So the pandemic is not. Is not a good time for a uh, for a power cut. All right, there we go. You uh, farming away, Jimmy? Okie Pokey and I are doing um, are doing a Swiss Alps together. So we've been on tonight doing that. She's uh, she's headed off to bed now. So, and I'm still carrying on. Twenty twenty's been a really, really strange one. Twenty twenty we've had um we've had bushfires, massive bushfires. We've had the COVID pandemic. Uh I nearly died when I got electrocuted in my job, when I got electrocuted in the ceiling. And then while I was away uh on this trip in New South Wales. Um, I, I nearly died on the road, so I got uh, a car ran out in front of us while we were doing 100 k's an hour, and uh, we we locked everything up and stopped like two inches away from him. So it's been a it's been a shocker. Two warm two more weeks of lockdown, but you'd be um you'd be driving around um all the uh, essential workers, kids and stuff, wouldn't you, Jimmy? Did you end up having some type of time off? Yeah, I know it was, it was it was pretty horrible. And the worst thing is that they say stuff comes in threes with that, but like, you know, where no matter what happens, we still party. <laughs> in your long white socks and your tan shorts. Raul. Well, Rail's got an awesome attitude, absolutely awesome attitude. He's a wonderful fella. You love your cargo pants. <laughs> absolutely. Hey, Jimmy, I, um, I bought a Switch, a Nintendo Switch, and I bought Farm Sim for Nintendo Switch on it, which is basically... Um, the full version of Farm Sim 17, and I took it away with me. So I was in the hotel rooms at night, just uh, just farming. <laughs> Farm Sim 24-7, then Sim. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I only stir Raoul up because he's from Florida. No, I didn't get Animal Crossing. <laughs> I said that to my daughter. I said, um, I said, oh, I, I, I seen Animal Crossing, but I didn't get it. <laughs> and she said, no, Animal Crossing wouldn't be any good for you, Dad. You wouldn't enjoy it. Hey, Jimmy, are you still there, Jimmy? Ah, you are. 14 days of isolation. <gasps> yeah, that's right, you were. Did you farm for 14 days? Hey, Jimmy, uh, Gailey Lame is my daughter, is my eldest daughter. What Animal Crossing's a simulation? You know, it's really funny though, like as gamers and stuff, like having a 14 day isolation, other than the financial burden of that is actually, it's actually pretty cool because you get, um, because you just get to game for 14 days, late nights, lots of gaming. 
playing most of the time. Exactly. That's exactly right. Why not? It's kind of like a holiday, Jimmy. What what um, what map are you playing at the moment, mate? Bit craving a burger. Oh, don't make me hungry. Don't make me hungry, guys. Oh, really? I didn't realise that House Flipper was on the Switch. There you go. Six Ashes with Maze Plus. Is Maze Plus hard? Is it complex? This is a lot of work for 720 euros, isn't it really? Does it have stripes, the rail? That's the, that's the question that Lan is itching to ask. There is a train on this map. Yes, indeed. I pointed it out to you before. <laughs> Got an itchy ear. There we go. It's itched. Oh, that's all right. How many, how many are... Um, Ah, oh, talking to Jimmy. How many are you playing on that map, James, this time? No train, no service. When's that new train simulation coming out, Rail? Eight. Eight of you. That's a big map. Oh, food. I have to check the Discord out, sweetie. All right, there you go. Uh, really, really good, really good. I think Hokey had a bit of a hard time while I was away, though. Well, I was away for a week. Quarter three next year. There you go. So they bought out a um, tram simulator. But apparently it's really expensive to buy and it's only got one route on it and that's it. I don't know why I was doing that again. Who said it's crap, though? Ah, uh, good night, sweetie. Sleep well. Full of bugs. There you go. Sleep well, sweetie. Sleep well, Naz. If you if you're still listening. I know that Squirrel was whinging about it, but Squirrel whinges about absolutely everything since he became an arrogant prick. Did I say that? I might have done. He became really, really rude, started being really, really rude to his viewers and stuff. G'day, Kane. How you doing? Welcome back. It's really funny. I've seen um, I've seen you. I've watched you some YouTubers and stuff grow, and grow and grow and grow, and then they get to a certain point, and then they just start being really, really rude to um, 
they start being really, really rude. I think, I think it was pointed out. I think I think people started pointing it out to him, and he started losing a lot of people, rail, and uh, he realised that he needed to pull his head in a little bit. I think that's what happened. Yeah, he 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 has been pretty nasty with a lot of people. So it's t like I've I've watched a couple of times and he's just really 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 rude to people. It's terrible. Uh Northern Northern Alex I would I would listen to most definitely. Most definitely. Washing machine broke. Oh, the motor. Damn it. Um, oh, we're talking about um, tram, the tram simulator. I don't know what it's called. We're talking about that. But um, who was the company that bring out um, tourist bus and stuff? I can't remember. No worries. <laughs> no worries, Goof. It was great to see you again, mate. You take care, buddy. Be safe. Yeah, we're also roasting squirrel. Yeah, you know, no offense to people who like who, who love squirrel and stuff, but he, but he he has been treating his uh, his his viewers really quite mean lately. Time to dim the work light. <sighs> the work light should never dim. Have a good day, mate. TML. Yep. Um, they're bringing out a new bus simulator soon. So I'm actually looking really forward to that. Thanks, Rail. I'm actually looking forward to that. I reckon it'd be really cool. Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. None of the stuff that they do is multiplayer, I don't think. But... Um, it's a, it's it's more of a city bus simulator as opposed to you know they've got the coach simulator which is um which is fern bus and then they've got uh, the tourist bus simulator which is actually pretty cool but this one's uh city buses so doing city bus routes and stuff which is should be really good brushing all the summer prickles out of your cats yeah and it's not even summer yet. Wait until summer. It's actually really nice. I didn't really, until I got the class DLC, I didn't really drive too many class tractors. Actually pretty cool. I got the class DLC because I kind of like some of the stuff in it. Uh, no, it's just a cultivator, just a cultivator cane. You know, it's really funny. Some of the some of the stuff that Aerosoft or, or a lot of the stuff that Aerosoft are involved in publishing is actually really, really, really poor quality. But uh, the stuff that TML Studios are doing is pretty is uh, that they've done is actually pretty good, really. I think they do a really good job. I know, I know. It'd be interesting if there was, Rao. If somebody did that, there's a train rail. Look, hey, there we go. Two. I got a power harrow on the front of my cedar, but I bought this. I don't know. I don't know why, because I think I can remove the power harrow from the cedar. I think. You want to drive it? Of course you do. Of course you do.
All right, there you go. Nearly done. Nearly done on this contract. I thought it'd be worth doing just a little contract and stuff while we're waiting for that stuff to happen. It's uh, 5 p.m., so we'll probably end up sleeping at some point. Then we better check Hokey Pokey's, um, make sure her sheep are all right as well. We also need to check our sheep's water. Or we'll have to do that first thing in the morning. See the real dirt mod. They've um, they've changed it now so that uh, so that it's harder for your stuff to wear off when you drive on real roads and stuff. It maintains the dirt, which is pretty cool. Thanks, Mikey. What do you guys think about um, you gamers? Think about all these companies like, um, say, for example, uh, like Dovetail, who who release a really a really really buggy crap game and then start releasing really really expensive dlc that costs more than the game uh before they've even fixed the base game because there's a lot of companies that are doing that stuff nowadays what do you guys think of companies that do that stop playing yeah did you refund it was it a game that you could refund kane Yeah, a lot of companies are doing that with simulations and stuff nowadays, which is um which is actually pretty sad really that they do that. Uh that should uh that should be finished that contract, shouldn't it? Yes it is. Let's collect our money for it. Lovely. Uh what have we got? Oh, you bought it over a year ago. I hate that. No, not giant. I don't. I don't think giants do. I think giants have decided to go a different way in this. But I don't know. Like, it was a long time after FS nine uh, FS nineteen was bought out that they started doing stuff like that, wasn't it? Really? Uh, that's field two. That's field three. It's field five. Let's do field three. We'll accept that one. So I don't know. I don't necessarily. I'm not sort of necessarily talking about that. What do you think, James? What do you think about um, about the the fact that they're um, that they're doing that? The giants have have gone down the DLC route. Uh, it's a bit bizarre. You can't, um, and you can't skip the intro or anything. Okay. Super liminal. It's a really interesting puzzle game. It isn't prohibitively hard. An amazing story. Okay. Uh, how do we get across there? So we might have to go, yeah, up that road maybe. They did, they did. I still kind of don't overly understand it. The one thing that really that upsets me about this is um, we all seen all those magnificent screenshots, you know, of beautiful skies and beautiful sunsets and all that type of stuff that giants spread out when this was coming out. And then all we get is this crappy, this really crappy sky and uh, the same kind of weather all the time. It's terrible. I, w I was really peeved off about that, to be honest, but... They're going to be going the same route as... Oh, really? 
So is there, is there never going to be another FS? Is it just going to be um, just continual, continual mods? Because you see SCS, like their mods, their mods are um, – like a lot of the updates and stuff that they put out and the new trucks and stuff like that are all um are all free, aren't they? And then there's stuff that you can buy as as DLC if you want to. I mean the 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 maps and stuff, but What was the what was the biggest hoo ha about um what was the biggest hoo ha about um about FS nineteen? Yeah, but that's kind of more what it's not it's it's kind of not not about that though, Raoul, this game, so Oh, they're supposed to be stopping, really? They're going to stop modding completely, are they? For that reason, so that they sell more DLC? I don't think there's a C. I mean, SCS, you know, they have DLC, don't they? What do you think, Jimmy? What were the other games that uh, that they used to do modding on? And they those those companies cut modding out in a new version. There've been there've been there's been a couple of those, hasn't there? Pretty sure there has. Because I mean, if you think about it, if they cut modding out of farm sim, there's going to be a lot of upset people. Yeah, I think it's a lot harder to make mods for console purely because there's um, the submission rules and stuff like that are even worse. And for consoles, I don't think I don't think they're allowed to do branded stuff, are they? For consoles or branded stuff that's not in the game or something. I might be wrong about that, but. I think like PlayStation and uh, Microsoft Xbox and stuff have um, have pretty stringent rules about that. So that's why the stuff that comes out on consoles all lizard stuff, and isn't it? Yeah, only ones that they've got license for there, which makes it harder on um, on console, really, doesn't it? So. Look at that, moving right along. Oh, don't hit the fence, rail. Don't hit the fence. Yeah, you have to worry about the space and stuff. I mean, I guess you do with a PC, depending on what you've got, but it's a lot easier to have extra storage space on a PC.
It'd be really good to have a multiplayer game that just had everything in it, wouldn't it? You know, farmers who produce produce, truck drivers who deliver produce, you know, aircraft like pilots that uh, fly cargo across to other countries and stuff and have it all interlocked. It hit you. <laughs> uh, crack up. Uh, yeah, stick to it too, Rao. Stick to it. Well, it's still really, really warm. It's like after midnight here now, and it's still really, really warm. It would be, but can you imagine the logistics of it? The programming? I wonder how Hokie's sheep are going. They should be all right. I'm pretty sure she filled them up with water before she left. Get what sort of for 2021? Jimmy, um, for... Is that going to be the next version of Farm Sim? Yeah, I have Kane. I've got um I've got I've got series um the series of um both of those games on my YouTube channel, Kane. Thanks, Mikey. There's the there's the link to my YouTube channel. So you can check out my two series that I've got running on those. I've had um I've had uh Lumberjack's Dynasty since the day it came out, the day of release. So I think I'm up to fifty something episodes on that. Yeah, I will. <laughs> I wish I was. I wish I was that clever, Jimmy. I wish I was that clever. I could probably program a simulator, but uh, not quite. Not quite that intense. I think it'd be a good idea, though. I think maybe you could do it between um, between all the different sims. If the if the devs would uh, if the devs would deal with you and talk to you, you could probably do something that works between the whole lot of them. Fifty four episodes, thank you, Mikey. There we go, Kane. I've got fifty four episodes of Lumberjack's Dynasty up, and I think I've probably got. 15, 14 or 15 of uh, Farmer's Dynasty because I just started the series on it not long ago. You want part of it. Episode 60, you want part of it. 20, wow, 20, really? Blimey. I'll we'll do some more of those uh, tomorrow. I'm going to be uh, recording some more of those tomorrow. For release this week. Also got to do myself another uh, Fishing North Atlantic as well. There we go. Yeah, I've got Trucker's Dynasty on uh, on my wish list. Did you just call me baby? Are you you getting a little bit uh, you getting a little bit sweet on the old simmy there, Al? Hey, eh? 
I mean, I know I'm a handsome man, but. All right. <laughs> uh, just stirring you up, buddy. Just stirring you up. Uh, all right. Lovely. This is actually, <laughs> for such a small cultivator, this is actually going to take quite a while, isn't it? I reckon. Yeah, I haven't managed to read them yet, um, Mikey. I had a busy day because uh, I've been spending time with Hokey and Bubs since I got back from work, since I got back from interstate. And um, so I was kind of trying to hold off a bit I haven't done any recording or anything yet, so since I've been back. Coffee. Oh, really? Nice. It's a good coffee, mate. Well, let's get this one done. <laughs> don't invite him he'll turn up into train or if there's no trains at your wedding then he'll be really really upset yeah there we go can i bring my train see i told you so it was a good coffee farmer was it awesome coffee You need to lay tracks <laughs> straight up the aisle for Mrs. Farmer to trip over. Oh, that's good. I had a really good coffee in a um, in a coffee shop in Wollongong actually while I was away. Can't remember the name of the coffee shop, but it was awesome. Yep, this is definitely going to take a considerable amount of time to do this field. Should have borrowed the uh, the equipment that they had to do it. <laughs> Mad Deb, <laughs> you're back on. You're just accumulating points for a um. Yeah, still streaming. Are you accumulating points for, for the goat scream? There we go. That's for you, buddy. <laughs> That's for you, my friend. There we go. Still streaming. Been streaming for uh, three and a half hours nearly. So. All right, there you go. Oh, that's what I didn't do. Let's... Uh... Let's bring that up as well so that I can see that. There you go. Sorry about that. Don't think I'm going to be streaming for, for too much longer. I've got to get up early with bubs in the morning or this morning. It's, um, although now farmers made me feel like a, a really feel like a really nice cup of coffee, but there ain't nowhere I can get one. There we go. Three hours, 24 minutes. Not bad for an old dude. Oh, but now I'll be on it. I'll go make everybody yawn. That's what's going to happen. Make everybody yawn. I should actually save this too. Should save it. Uh, where are we? Across this way. Save game. There we go. Beautiful.
As long as as long as it's not May Rail. It's been a uh, a pretty good night of farming. <laughs> Excellent work, mate. Uh, you're a crack up. You're a crack up, son. Right, beautiful. Oh, no, you've got to continue. You've got to continue to save. You've got to keep saving, especially on Dynasty games, Rail. Hello, Neary. Hey, how are you? I know you've been there, but your chin hasn't been working. Your chin, <laughs> your chin hasn't been working. I'm sorry that I'm streaming something that, that bores the hell out of you, Neary. I do apologise. You were asleep. That's good. Got to get sleep. Oh, I'm starting to yawn down there. Neary, if she's on, she may be there. Could have fallen asleep. Hard to tell with that one, honestly. <laughs> That's such a good one for you, Neary. We love you. There we go. Should join me to be not be tired. I probably is um oh no. See I'm yawning now. If I start yawning I'm gonna put Neri back to sleep. Gonna put her back to sleep. Uh, well, you got some sleep anyway, so that's good. Nearly 3 a.m. for sack. Yeah, don't forget we're playing tonight, mate. So, oh, that's going to be late for you, isn't it? If uh, About 8 o'clock tonight, guys. 8 o'clock my time tonight, sack. 8 or 9, because uh, we've got to, we've got to wait for Bullfrog as well. So... Don't want it to be, to be too early for him. <laughs> Relaxing, see me voice is soothing. I shall, uh, I shall just uh, do a private stream just for you, Neri, one night, and I will. I shall just read. I'll just read uh, Edgar Allan Poe or something for you. Bullfrog stays up all night because he works all night, doesn't he? All right, no worries, Sack. Beautiful. I will see you tonight, mate. Sleep well. Thank you very much for hanging out. Appreciate it very much, mate. And there's the frog. There's the frog. All right, there you go. This is going to take. This is going to take a considerable amount of time to do I can't remember what uh, what equipment we could have borrowed for this one but it's not worth that much anyway so some of these jobs by the time you borrow the equipment then you get practically nothing for them uh, 8 8.30 my time cap 8.30 my time, MDJ fell back asleep, that's all right, yeah, wake now, so earlier is probably better for him, yeah, there you go. Can't do it until I, uh, until I know Bubs is going to be asleep and stuff, so. Uh, it is now 12.25 p.m. for me, Cap. Uh, 
uh, a.m. Sorry, twelve twenty-five a.m. So. <laughs> Boo, wake, wake up. 13.54 in the UK. Mid-afternoon. <laughs> You've got more stamina than me though, Jimmy. Heaps more, mate. 8, 8.30 p.m. my time. 8.30 p.m. my time. Um, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll type it on Discord because uh, you've, got, you've got the time bot on Discord, haven't you? So it should tell you. Actually, I'll do, I'll do it right now for you, mate. I will do it right now. Hang on. Let's just get that happening. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna look at this magnificence right here. Driving a tractor, doing a field, and also posting on uh, on Discord. Let's see. Uh, let me see. No, I can't post it in there because nobody will see it in there. I will post it in general. Here we go, son of a welcome to Discord. Gamer John, welcome. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Uh, there we go. Welcome and at Bullfrog, at Bullfrog 2130. Oh, 21. Why isn't it doing it? 30. It's not doing the time thing. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just did it. Worker is off. <laughs> yeah, I, I cheated. I cheated. That is, a, that is a very, very nice number, farmer. Very nice number. <laughs> no worries jimmy thank you so much mate it was absolutely awesome to see you buddy you be safe and uh i hope your other half is safe as well thanks mate it was really good to see you again bullfrog i just um <laughs> jimmy's redeeming goat scream just for you and Jimmy, there's one for the other half as well. Hopefully she's being safe. <laughs> Mad Dev's happy about that. Uh, there's no worries, mate. See you, Jimmy. Uh, yeah, because... Um, because all the animals attended, the grass is cut, all the fields are all fertilised 100%, the weeds are gone. So I just thought I'd throw in a, a couple of jobs just to earn a little bit of money. So, but because I am um, got it, Bullfrog got it, excellent. Um, but because I am um, because I was just looking at some stuff on... Uh, on Discord and welcoming people to the uh, Discord community and stuff, then I, th I thought I'd hire a worker. 
didn't break the harvester, the harvester will be ready for tomorrow. It will be ready for tomorrow. So, but what I am going to do though, uh, he didn't really, the time zone thing isn't working again. Oh, really? Uh, let's see. Let me have a look. It's currently, it will be currently be close to 6 a.m. It's 6 a.m. in Seattle at the moment. What is it where you guys are? I hate working out time zones. I'm uh, GMT plus 9.30. I'm in the Adelaide, South Australia time zone. It's 2 p.m. Irish time, 9 a.m. in Florida, 8 a.m. where near he is. So if it's 8 a.m. where you are and it's uh, 12.31 where I am, then you need to take off seven and a half hours. Is that, is that, is that right? 9 a.m. in Ohio. Is that right? So you're seven and a half hours. Like you're not seven and a half hours in front of me because you're behind me, but you're seven and a half hours in front of me, but not. <laughs> now I'm getting, if you understand what I mean. So like if it's nine, if it's 9.30, if it's nine, if it's 8.30 p.m. for me, Add seven and a half hours to that, and that'll tell you what time it'll be for you. But just don't take any notice of the days, if you understand what I mean. Where's the banana when you need her? Where's the genius banana? Hmm. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Oh, um. So if it's currently 6.02 a.m., I uh, know if it's currently 8 a.m., that's seven and a half hours. So I reckon it'd be, I'll tell you what, Bullfrog, you were here when this stream started. Don't rub it in, Farmer. Don't rub, rub it in. We're just working out time zones, time zones, genius banana. So you were here when the stream started, Bullfrog, weren't you, this morning? Time zone letters. Uh... What, what are our time zone letters, banana? It's not Eastern Standard Times. If you take Eastern Standard Time, E-S-T, or A-E-S-T, and remove, it's 12.30. It's 12.30 for me. So 12, so A-E-S-T, <laughs> A E S T is uh, is the East Coast, and they're half an hour ahead of us. So if you take the A E S T time, actually, let me look it up. I'm just going to look it up. I should know that. What you do is on your smartphone, yeah, everybody's so confused, on your smartphone, no, that's Greenwich Mean Time, we're, we're GMT plus 9.30, on, on your smartphone, just add Adelaide, South Australia as, a, uh, as an extra time on your smartphone. South Australian time zone, uh, A-C-D-T. ACDT, which is Australian Central Daylight Time. Or 
or ACT, Australian Central Time. Yeah, ACDT, Australian Central Daylight Time. I should know that. And generalised time zone in South Australia is ACT, Australian Central Time. Currently being used in South Australia is ACDT, which is Australian Central Daylight Time. And it's Australian Central Daylight Time because we're in Daylight Savings. <laughs> I don't know. It's, it's all too confusing. It's all too confusing. Ah, stupid time zones. I think all, all of you guys should all move to South Australia and then we'll all be on the same time zone. What do you reckon? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, there we go. Add 16 hours and 30 and 30 minutes to get semi time from your time. Hmm. I need to move to the States. <laughs> Wouldn't you want to come out here, Raul, and live with all of the snakes and the spiders, the super hot temperatures, the deserts, the resident banana? Uh, eight hours, 30 minutes difference. There is eight hours, 30 minutes difference, kind of. Though. Stupid, confusing time zones. Well, I mean, this tractor's going to run out of money before this job's done. There goes the train, Ra. Nine a.m. Saturday morning. Here, Kane. It is. Uh, t it is 12.38 a.m. Sunday morning. Ah, oh, yeah, that sounds good. Done. Done, farmer. <laughs> Banana's moving too. We do love our trains here. You should see some of our trains here, Rao. They are indeed. They are indeed. Now, uh, let's see. So... Um, I bullfrog nineteen and a half hours. We're going to play in nineteen and a half hours from now. So whatever time it is for you in 19 and a half hours, that's the time. That will probably be the easiest way. Yes. Yes, that would be a bad mistake, wouldn't it, Banana? 
like that. I like the sternness. I like the sternness. Banana is most certainly not moving. Most certainly not. Jeez, it's getting warm in here. All these time zones, all these time zones. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That is true, Lana. Look at that. Look at that, that lighting. Look at all of that awesome lighting. Ah, oh, well, I think I'm going to call it a stream, guys. Did you get that though, Bullfrog, in 19 and a half hours? From now, it probably puts you at about 4.30 a.m. or something, maybe. 4.30 or 5.30 a.m. Oz is ahead of you and the USA is behind you. So confused. I know it does. It does. <laughs> this is your next goat scream. 3 a.m. Perfect. <laughs> there we go, Mad Deb. Uh, <laughs> it's cool. Too early. Ah, but the frog's up though. The frog's up all night, you see. Takes all night to charge his lasers. His laser, my laser. All right, guys, I am going to call this stream right here. For some reason, I don't know why, but uh, the audio didn't go on for that. Who knows why? Ah, uh, yes, after doing some trucking, you'd probably be, uh, sound the horn. <laughs> it'll, it'll make. It'll make it a lot easier, won't it, Neary? <laughs> I can't do the horn because they uh, are workers driving the tractor at the moment. Well, it would make it that so much easier, Neary. I don't know why we didn't think of that in the first place. Uh, yeah, no, oh, the sound's been on, but I think it was when I came back from a break. When I came back from the break, when Hokey went to bed, I uh, I muted the sound. I don't know what I don't know what sound I put on it. <laughs> it put the alert box on. That's why. I didn't put the sound back on when I touched it because I use an iPad. So got your alarm ready. Perfect. All right, guys. I am going to go. I am going to call this a stream. Thank you so much for watching. It's actually been really relaxing tonight. Hope everybody stays really, really safe no matter where you are in the world. I am getting back into farming. Night, Neary. I'm glad that you managed to get some sleep. I hope those, uh, I hope you start feeling better. Of course you can, Mikey. Go for it. It's good to see you again, Kane. It's good to see you again. It's good to see all of you again. It's been awesome. Mad Deb, it was great to see you again as well. Very, very, very cool. No, there's not. No, there's not. 
when the rain comes, okay. When the rain comes. Thank you very much, Farmer, for your gifts and stuff tonight. Really, really, really appreciate it. So much. Yeah, you stay safe too, Banana. Uh, I think Ra wants everybody to move to Florida. I'm wondering whether, um... I'm wondering whether Rao's actually the mayor of Florida. Or the governor of, of the state of Florida. Is he? Is he the governor of the state of Florida? Because it's called governor over there, isn't it? Mayors are mayors of towns. He might be. Farmer redeemed a goat scream just for you, sir. <coughs> Lovely. Lovely. Thank you so much, Farmer. It means the world to, to Hokie and I. One for the road. One for the road. Air pressure change before the rain. Ah, okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Alright, guys. If you want to carry on with the conversation, head over to uh, head over to Discord and, and have a chat there. Third train system for high speed, and Rao's going to be in charge of it all. I will see all of you guys uh, on Tuesday night for a stream, for just a very short one on Tuesday night though. But uh, thank you very much for watching this one. You s I hope you get some more sleep too, Neri. You be safe. Froggy, hope you get some sleep and be safe too. Everybody be safe because it's a, it's, a, it's a crap world at the moment. So I will see all you guys later. Thank you very much. Uh, they just automatically do when the tractor's near. Rail. It's a ghost in the road. See you guys. Be safe.